skeleton. Man. No. Skeleton. Man. Yeah, that makes sense. Predictable. E. Man.
Yes. Fantastic. Love this OST. Haven't played this game yet. Maybe we'll get to it. I think it's based on a movie, and I haven't seen the movie either. Uh, let me see here. Gebisu, thank you for the follow. Adam Admar, thank you for the 36 whole stonk markets. Kaku Epsilon, thank you for the 23 whole years. PK something. Thank you for the 53 whole years. Breezak, thank you for the 34 whole years. <laughs> Sanford and Sonius, thank you for the three whole years. Frog Race, you already know what it is. Place your bets. The IRS will claim 30% of your winnings. I think you're lowballing it, honestly. <laughs> Are we committing tax fraud today? Uh, for legal reasons, no. All right, betting time is over. It looks like Frog from Frog. Frog from Race, the main character of Frog Racing. 38% to this bet. Habitual half-stepper, thank you for the 55 whole frogs. Start the frog race! Who's got the lead? Frog number three is already halfway across. Everybody's trying to catch up. I don't think they can! Though, wait a minute! Oh, he did get there! Can't believe it. It looked... <laughs> it looked so assured that frog number four had overtaken. He almost blew it. He had a huge lead. He almost blew it, but he held on... Paying out to Sir Hops a lot. 270,000 new yen given to 16 lucky winners. Congratulations to all 16 of you. My condolences to everybody else who did not win. You picked fourth four times in a row. Don't worry. It's just a cold streak. The next one, you're going to win. Guaranteed. Just remember, 90% of frog racers, they quit just before they hit it big. That's that's the truth. Hey Stampede, how about a poem? They twist like quad coiled vipers feeding on combustion's waste. Black as ink and hot as Hades, they join below. Eternally in shadow, unless of course I roll. They belch a rumbling and vibrate fear into the bones of my foe. Mm, thank you, Stampede. Hi, hello, everyone. Hope everyone had a good weekend. Had a pretty good weekend. It was pretty relaxing. Now we gotta get into the nitty-gritty. As we all know, tax season is officially over, or is about to be. I assume you've all filed your taxes. I've certainly filed mine. But I was in the mood to play games about making questionable financial decisions. I have a confession to make. I love video games about making questionable financial decisions. And there's quite a lot of games in that genre. But this is one of those rare occasions where even, like, the most well-known game in that genre is, like, still pretty dank. Like, extremely dank. So I figure we might as well start there for once and play the least dank one. <laughs> in 1988, the money game came out, made by Sofell, one of the greatest developers ever, because all their games had to do with making really bad financial decisions. The rest of the world did not get money game. Yeah, the money game. The rest of the world did not get this game. But they certainly got money game too. Wasn't called money game two because it wouldn't make sense. Nobody got money game one. So obviously, when the rest of the world got it, 
It was Wall Street Kid. By rest of the world, I mean, like, specifically North America. We're playing Wall Street Kid! Of course we are! I mean, if we're gonna play some stonks games, we might as well get, like, the most popular one out of the way. I mean, even Wall Street Kid's extremely dank. <laughs> so, fuck it. Just play Wall Street Kid, why not? Yeah, John Salary Man, the game. Let's look at the back of the box. What we got in here? Where life, love, and money all depend on how well you play the game. Make billions in italics of dollars when you deal with the giants of Wall Street. Not only do you take risks by playing the stonk market, you must prove you can uphold a high standard of living. If you dream of fame and fortune, this life simulation game is your way to the top. You can taste the victory of success, but only if you're strong enough to face the challenge of life now are you ready to deal i'm not i'm probably not how hard could it be i love that the box art is just an american comic book cover truly wall street kid is all about truth justice and the american way <laughs> thank you tepid steak ah uh, wall street kid a game that seemed absolutely freaking ludicrous in 1990, and today would likely be a potentially acclaimed hit indie game. Eh, it wasn't that ludicrous in 1990. Money Game was already out two years before in <laughs> the same series. There have certainly been Stonks games before this one. Hell, there's fucking, what, Drug Wars? On the TI-82? Drug Wars was a thing. I think that predates this as well. It's pretty cool, though. It's pretty cool. Let's play some Wall Street, kid. So fell, my beloved. Oh. Featuring Wall Street Kid himself, Priscilla, the pricey prima donna, Larry, the lofty lawyer. Good. This is good. Ruth the Ruthless Banker. Stanley the Crafty Consultant. Connie the Arrogant Advisor. She seems nice. Ralph the Regal Realtor. Doc the Bogus Boat Salesman. <laughs> Pamela the Patient Pet Dealer. Yeah. Cal the Cranky Car Dealer. It is some good characters. Ted the Tough Stereo Man. Art the Artsy Artist. Dion, the dashing designer. Julie, the jolly jeweler. Austin, the astute auctioneer. There's a lot of characters. Okay, that's everyone. That's all the cast of heroes. Hey, hey, hey. Put me in, coach. Hello, I'm Larry, a lawyer employed by your distant uncle, Mr. Benedict. I'm sorry to say, he's passed away. Alright, can we get some Fs in chat for our uncle? Our uncle, Mr. Benedict, he's already dead. We just started. I can't believe it. As his only surviving relative, you may be eligible to inherit over $600 billion in assets. Holy shit, we're filthy, stinking rich. First, you must prove yourself. You'll be provided with half a million dollars, with which you must turn a profit through the stock Wait, market. How can Ruth be a ruthless banker? Her being Ruth means that she has to have at least one Ruth, so she isn't ruthless. She's lying. Don't trust her. Somebody shoot that guy. Sir Leifu, thank you for the 35 old ears. Wait until we get out of the intro first. We got lore to get through. Thank you, Sly Dante. Thank you, Sir Leifu. Use the profits to uphold the Benedict standard of living. Pamper your sweetheart and move into a decent one million dollar house. Yes, just a decent one, you know. There's definitely shitty one million dollar houses. You'll have one month to purchase the house. I'll have a real estate agent call you. Also, Mr. Benedict's grandfather owned a castle in Europe years ago. When he emigrated to the U.S., the castle had to be sold. Oh my god. 
We lost a castle. Just before Mr. Benedict's death, he heard gossip that the castle would go up for sale. You must buy it back to maintain the family heritage. Jesus Christ, I have to buy a whole castle, dude. The castle will cost several million dollars. So prepare yourself. I'll keep you posted on this sale. And yeah, that's a lot of tasks. Oh, by the way, have a great April Fool's Day. But remember, everything I just told you is no April Fool's joke. Good luck! We should have played this on April Fool's Day. Clearly. Oh shit, we're in. April 3rd, 9 o'clock, the Wall Street Times. Economy, interest rates have dropped by 0.5%. Market data, blue chip and cyclical stonks surpass others. So, to the best of my ability, we're gonna play this video game. We're gonna try and figure out how stonks work. I've never done a stonks in real life. I've never, have you? I've never done a stonks. Hot Stocks Bulletin, Boeing, Carnivore Cruise Lines, American Depress, Rattel Toys, and Fired Man's Fund. Excellent names. News headliners. Local rock band hits Stone City again by storm. Three days added to their sold-out concert. Yeah, Boeing. <laughs> it's pretty good. Hello, my name is Ralph. I'm a real estate agent. Larry told me that you're interested in purchasing a house for around one million dollars. I'm looking at some very nice homes for sale at the moment. I'll get the details and call you at the beginning of next week. Bye for now! Don't threaten me. Don't threaten me with a phone call. What are any of these buttons? Here I go. Hello, sir. My name is Connie. I have an excellent investment tip for $1,000. Do we have a deal? Yeah, sure. Carnivore announced plans for industrial expansion. I think they should consider producing vegetables. Ha 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 ha! Ha! Ha ha ha! Come back soon. I'll always have more info. Goodbye. Hello, my name is Stanley. Would you like me to explain the stock market to you for $500? Yes. Please, God. What would I like to know? Tell me everything. Tell me everything. I would love to hear about the stock market. Tell me more. Stocks are money, which a company divides into shares of equal amounts that are bought and sold in the stock market. Buying stock in a company makes you part owner. This much I knew. Yeah, write this down, write this down. A company issues you stock certificates to represent the number of shares you've purchased. Or in other words, how much of the company you own. By becoming a stockholder, you receive a percentage of the profits that the company makes. It also means you can attend stockholder meetings. At the meetings, you're given information on company business and are allowed to express your opinion through your percentage of votes. Thank you very much for your business. I'll be here anytime you want to learn more about the stonk market. Ah, shit. We have to give him 500 more dollars to ask for, like, another tip. Mike! Just a suggestion. Never get hired by Boing. Their checks always bounce. <laughs> Why did they say Boing like that? <laughs> Thank you. Shit, it's 11. Check the newspaper. Who was up? Who's Wait, who's up right now? Interest rates have dropped by half a percent. Blue chip and cyclical stocks surpass others. Who's hot right now? Boeing? Carnivore? American Depress? Rattel Toys? Fireman's Fund? Got it. What are we- what are we investing in? Are we investing in Boeing? Are we investing in, uh... <laughs> American Depress is pretty good. What did Connie say? Connie said that, uh, American Depress should expand into vegetables. That's what she said. It wasn't a real tip. I don't think. Info. Tell me more. 
Tell me more about Carnivore. Starting price, 34. Currently 34. It's a cyclical stock, which is good. That's good. Because those are up right now. Transportation and entertainment company ready for growth. Expanded into hotels and travel. Sell a profit from $500 million. All right. I have the perfect plan. Frog races. <laughs> Frog races. Yapple is a very good name. <laughs> Tell me more. Tell me more about Yapple Computer. They have an excellent new product line. Very compatible with YBM. Capable of major growth. <laughs> you might have to invest in some Yapple. <laughs> Yo, Rebucks? Yes! Very successful footwear manufacturer on the way of being number one high debt. Yeah, Xerox? I'm tempted to go Carnivore or Rattel Toys. I mean, we want to buy cheap stocks, right? Because if we buy a really expensive stock, we'd have less of them total. If we buy really cheap stocks and then they go up, it basically, like, multiplies the, the uppage. Right? <laughs> we're gonna go Carnivore and we're gonna go Retail Toys. I think that's the plan. Here I go. It's time to buy some stonks. It's my asset allocation. I got nothing, Captain. I got half a million dollars. All right, five, five st uh, seven stonks. Seven stonks of carnivore. I can only have 14. We're gonna take seven of those. And then we're gonna buy some, uh, then we're gonna buy some, some retail toys. I can hold seven of these, yep. No, no. <laughs> there we go. That feels good. Put all my eggs in one basket, that way I can have a big basket. You might be right. Marry me with Belly. My money. Reminder, never bounce checks, but make sure to pay the bouncers. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Thank you, Belly, for the dollar -y do. Picnic, shopping, carnival, the because bouncer, you see in this video game, bouncer, we're not just doing stonks. Bouncer, we also have to maintain the, the bouncer, uh, relationship the bouncer, with our fiancé. The bouncer, the bouncer, the bouncer. We could go on a picnic. That sounds like a wonderful the idea. We'll have a lovely two hours. The We've successfully gone on a picnic with our fiancé. Can I go swimming? Good decision. Swimming is very good for your health. Transaction takes two hours. Because, you see, you actually have to make sure that uh, you're in good health and that your fiancé is in good spirits. Or else you will lose this video game. It's not just stonks. Uber Wolf Man. Like no thought card gambling was for chumps. Now we in the big league gamblers. True. So I think we have until like nine to five every day. So it's about to be seventeen hours. So if there's anything else we can do today, let's see. Stanley here. How are you doing? Give me another tip. Tell me more. Tell me more. I got mo I got money to spend. Tell me about stonk prices. Tell me more. We gotta get all the tips. Timing is very important in the stock market. To make money, you must buy stocks while they're selling low and sell stocks when they're selling high. Stock prices depend mainly on supply and demand. The more buyers, the higher the prices. The more sellers, the lower the prices. Several things can affect stock prices. Company sales, company plans, and interest rate fluctuations. The more sensitive a company is to changes in interest rates, the more risky the investment. Interest rate changes affect how much you can spend and buy. When interest rates increase, you'll tend to save more and spend less. During a recession, prices are high, therefore you tend to spend less. The more debt a company has, that is, the more money they owe, the more sensitive they are to interest rates. The higher the asset base, that is, all property and goods that have high value, the less sensitive the company is to interest rates. Did you get all that? Write that down. 
Oh shit, we're up! We got $518,000! Oh shit, we're up, dude! Number go up! I'm excited. Yo, big money! Interest rates are dropping while prices remain stable. Market data, blue chip and cyclical stocks surpass others. Hot Stocks Bulletin, Carnivore Cruise Lines, Rattel Toys, they're still up. They're still hot stocks at the moment, so we should just keep- we should hold them, yeah? We just hold on to them? <laughs> Prince Lopo Loco going to marry American heiress. Combined worth is over 75 billion dollars. Pull off the returns, reinvest them elsewhere? That sounds quite advanced. That sounds like an advanced, like, uh, secret maneuver. I'm not sure we can do that. What is this button? Hello, how can I help you? Need loan? How much can you loan me? I'm sorry, sir. I cannot process your loan if you have no collateral to apply against it. Shit, dude, I got nothing. I got no assets. I'm finished. I'm ruined. We need real estate. Yeah, dude. Tell me more. Tell me how to acquire news. If you tell me to read the fucking newspaper, if I spend $500 and you tell me to read the newspaper to get the fucking news, you're fired. You're finished in this town. By reading all financial news and reports, and with lots of luck, you should be able to make intelligent and profitable stock investment. During the business week, newspapers could usually give you valuable info on fluctuations in the stock market, interest rates, and the economy. This can be helpful when attempting to predict the stock price per each stock category. Professional analysts and consultants can provide you with info on the past, present, and future status of companies. This can really help you to know the popularity or unpopularity of a company. That's all he had to say. <laughs> yeah, we need to defenestrate him. I agree. I don't think I can afford any stonks. Could I buy another carnivore stonk? No. I can't afford any of these. That's okay. Read the paper? We already did, though. <laughs> yeah, that's the guy. Kill him with hammers. Let's go shopping with the fiancé. Brilliant idea! You know how I love to shop. You, uh, I'll enjoy those four hours. Good. Excellent. Oh, dude, can I go to the gym? Sorry, we're closed. Shit! I'm finished. I'm ruined! Can I go hiking? Hiking trail is closed. I can't believe this. Can I go swimming again? Shit! No workout today. No gains today, gamers. I'm ruined. PK something. You are given the choice between $5,000 and a book that tells you the secret to get rich quick. Mm -hmm. You take the book. You open it to page one. Should have taken the money, dumbass. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. Tell me how to buy and sell stocks. I think I got it figured out, though. You can purchase stonks using your own personal computer, which is connected to the large computer at a securities corporation. Is that where we work? For your convenience, stock prices are displayed on your screen. Transactions have to be made by lots. One lot is equal to 1,000 shares of stock in this game. So I actually bought, like, a million billion shares then, instead of just a few. Percentage changes are also shown on your screen to indicate whether the stock price has increased or decreased from the previous day. How much money you have at any particular time during the game will depend on how wise you make your stock investments. I see. I see, I see. Oh, it's the next day. 553! We're so back! Man, this game wants more out of the player than I do in my own life. Put it all in American Depress, you'll make a killing. <laughs> if they ever- if they ever go up, what do we do? Do we just hold these until... Are we stonks maxing? I think so. We're filthy stinking rich at the moment. Sell one lot. Carnivore and Rattel are still up. 
But we could put one in YBM. YBM is a hot stock right now. How about we sell one each? And then we put them... Let's sell one each. And then we'll buy two stocks of YBM. <laughs> More giant cockroaches invade small South Seas Island. Giant cans of Rado used without success. Oh no, dude. I'm never going swimming again. The <laughs> monster movie setting. What am I holding? I'm holding seven stonks of carnivore and seven of retel. So they started at 34 and 35, respectively. And now they're at 40 and 39, respectively. Let's sell two stock. Well, let's say let's sell two shares of carnivore. Buy stonks. I've got ninety-two thousand dollars. YBM is up. Jesus Christ, they're expensive. I can't even afford one. I can't even afford one. They're too much. Yeah, two stonks of YBM? No way, I can't even get one. I think Xerox was also up, though, weren't they? I can't afford that, either. Yeah, you're right. Alright, I'm just gonna put those right back where they were. <laughs> I'm gonna put those right back where they were. <laughs> no, why not? I already know that I'll lose money. Correct. True. I mean, I can also just not buy anything. <laughs> not the stonks backseating. I mean, I can also just hold this money until something else is a hot stock. I think this music is gonna make me go insane by the end of the day. Got a feeling. Tell you what, a better idea. Let's go hiking, because I've got nothing else to do today. Right? Let's just go hiking, fuck it. Sorry, hiking trail closed! We can't go hiking, boys. Let's go to the gym. Let's get personal gains instead of financial gains. Good decision. Working out is very good for your health. We worked out for four hours. Ain't no way. I would have been gassed in the first 30 minutes. Let's go to a picnic. That sounds like a wonderful idea. We'll have a lovely two hours. Yeah, fair enough. I think we hit the clock to advance to the next day. Oh, we went back up! The Wall Street Times. Interest rates are dropping while prices remain stable. Blue chip and cyclical stocks are still up. That's good. What's hot right now? Carnivore, Rattel, Boeing, YBM, Xerox. We could buy some stocks in Boeing. <laughs> we could buy some Boeing stock. The art world goes into shock as a Warholski print goes up for sale at four hundred million dollars. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna buy a Boeing stock. Yeah, it's 1990. Bro, I can't afford this either. Everything's too expensive. These stonks, they're insane. Even if a Boeing stock falls, Holy it'll just bounce back. <laughs> a Boeing, thank you for the 100 Boeings. I actually can't afford any of the bigger stonks. We'd probably, I mean, we could get more carnivore. We can get more carnivore stonks, but I feel like they're probably going to drop soon. But we're already up so much money. We're already up like 100k on where we started. So I'm content to just kind of hold what we're holding. Yeah, the company no, names no, are fantastic. Sir. We could buy Pan Ma'am. Is it a blue chip or a cyclical steak? Or a cyclical uh, stonk? Pan Ma'am, let me see. It said that like blue chip and cyclical stocks were up. This is a speculative stock. 
A one-time giant has high debt, low assets. Sales are high, but so are the losses. Mm. I do have money, though. What if? I mean, it's really cheap, right? It's what? It's 26 bucks right now. Well, how about we just get them? <laughs> yeah, it's the cheapest one. Here I go. I can only buy three of these. I'll do it. I'll take them. I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? <laughs> I'm gonna regret that decision. Fiance, shopping. Brilliant idea. You know how I love to shop. I'll enjoy those four hours. Do you think, chat room, that you could go shopping for four hours? Do you think you'd survive? I don't think I'd survive. There's no way. <laughs> Get me out of this relationship. All right, next day. Oh, we're up again. No. The Wall Street Times. Economy. Interest rates are dropping. Prices remain stable. Market data. Blue chip and cyclical stocks are still up. That's good. Who's hot right now? Rattel, Boeing, Carnivore dropped. Carnivore dropped. Oh. Carnivore was the number one stonk. Now they're the number three stonk. News headlines. More giant cockroaches invade the ocean. <laughs> A quick cash out. Huh? Who's calling that phone? Hi, honey. I really love dogs. Can I please have one? Well, if you promise to take good care of it, we can go for a look tomorrow. Thanks, honey. I'll see you tomorrow. What? <laughs> yeah, you! What am I holding? I've got seven shares of Carnivore, five shares of Rattel Toys, three shares in Pan Mam. Whatever happened to owning a pet rock? I'm gonna sell two shares of Carnivore because it looks like it's on its way down. I'm gonna sell two of them. Just two. And then maybe we get some more Pan Mam. It's gonna go up. Currently, Pan Mam is at $24, right? It's actually cheaper than it started at. It started at 25. Bro, if we buy this dip. <laughs> Here I go. Here I go, making bad plays. Check this shit out. More. More Pan Mam. It's gonna work. It's gonna work out. It's gonna work. The logic is sound. <laughs> it's time to catch a falling knife. Let's go to the gym. Good decision. Working out is very good for your health. Transaction takes four hours. Yeah, it's gonna hit twenty dollars. We're up to like six hundred... Six hundred nineteen K. We started at half a mil, so it's not going too bad. Next day. Oh shit! God is my witness. We are about to lose our damn shit. We're gonna be bankrupt by the end of the, uh, of the day. That's my promise to you. We're gonna absolutely be bankrupt. We're gonna be living in a cardboard box. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. We're going dog shopping. We'd like to have a look at some dogs. We have a poodle for $1,000, a chihuahua for $500. Would you like either of them? No, but my wife does. Uh, I'll take the poodle, I suppose. Does this affect anything? I feel like I have to buy the expensive shit. Does this game have, like, a good ending and a bad ending? I feel like I need to get, like, the best shit so that she's happy. <laughs> I'll do it. I'll take the poodle. Thanks, honey. He's adorable. Your password is... Ah. Oh. Yeah, write that down. Write, uh... Oh. <laughs> Ooh. I don't know about this password. Tell you what. Here's the plan. Every time I'm given a password, 
how about instead of having to ever input this bullshit, how about we save state on the password screen and we'll just consider that to be valid and then if we have to back up, we'll rewind right here to where it shows me the password. That way we don't have to spend 30 minutes putting in a goddamn password. The Wall Street Times economy. Interest rates have dropped by 0.5%. Your password is e e e e e. I e. wish. Is way longer than that, sadly. Thank you, Shadrock. E. Market data. Rising stocks are e. outpaced e. by blue chip and growth stocks. So, e. do we want to get rid of our... E. E. Cyclical ones? Which is what? Carnivore and Rattel. I think they were both cyclical stocks. Do we want... Do we want to grab growth? Yeah, cash out by growth stocks? Maybe. Hot Stocks Bulletin. Who's up? Fireman's Fund. American Depress. Rebucks International. Boeing Carnivore Cruise Lines. Are we going all in on American Depress? Rattel is gone entirely. So we should sell our Rattel stocks, right? We should get rid of those. <laughs> Boing. News headliners. Up and coming video software company hits it big with a high stakes game. Soon to be number one. I wonder who they're referring to. My favorite thing about this screen is the newspaper that says... I like the newspaper that says today, 1990. I feel every newspaper should just say today instead of the date. <laughs> Hello, this is Ralph. I found a gorgeous house for you. In fact, the owner is a friend of yours, John Feld. I know you love the house. John said you were raving about it at his last party. Did I? I don't remember that. Was I drunk? I don't remember saying this. Streamer, I humbly request to inform me about the results of your stocks later as I will be at the airport and not G equals etting anything mm -hmm. confiscated this time because I learned my lesson. Fraud. Y'all have a swell time at the airport, Danny. Thank you for the 500 bits. Don't worry, I will not report you to the authorities. <laughs> the cost is exactly $1 million. Your present credit status doesn't show any acquired assets to be applied against a loan, so you'll have to have the cash up front. If you agree to buy now and end up not having enough money on Saturday, you'll lose the deal. No. A mill? I can't make a mill in a week. No. No, thank you. Nah, I'm good. Keep it. Keep the house. I don't want it. Keep it, friend. Okay. If the house is still for sale in a week, I'll call you to see if you're ready to buy. Exchange dog for house. Yeah, totally. Uh, I gotta check the newspaper again. What was up? We need to sell our stocks. We need to sell our cyclical stocks. That, mu that much I know because they're not even listed here. We need blue chip and growth stocks now. So we need to sell Carnivore and Rattel. Yeah, can't we just rob a bank? Sell stocks. I mean, they are pretty high. <laughs> Wait, why do I have two separate investments in Pan? Man, <laughs> I thought they'd all go into the same pile. That's fine. Sell. Sell, we need blue chip and growth stocks. Yeah, there were two separate buy prices, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> How's your mental state so far with this music? Has the music loop driven you insane yet? How are we how are we feeling? <laughs> <laughs> what music? Yeah, I know. What is... So we need growth... stocks. Wait a minute. Check the... Check the info. 
We're looking for growth stocks. Who was up? They said that Fired Man's was up. Fired Man's Fund is a growth stock. Successful insurance firm heading for a peak in sales may diversify into other areas. American Depress was up, right? American Depress stock category growth. Successful financial services company. High market value, high sales, strong growth. And then I think Boeing was also on there. That's a bit rich for my blood. Jesus Christ. It's a blue chip. Very strong domestic and export manufacturer of airplanes. Excellent past Welcome record. To the zone. Get ready. Toast Sandwich, thank you for the follow. Excellent past record. They wouldn't lie. They wouldn't lie to us. <laughs> okay, so I think we need to buy either American Depress or Fired Man's. They're both at 69 nice dollars. I think that's maybe the play. What else is a growth stock, though? I guess we have to check the fucking list again. Are there any other growth stonks? AT&T? No, it's blue chip. Very strong communications company that now has to compete for their market. Bethlehem, that's strong. Speculative. Under new management. Showing profitability. Industry uncertainty. Recession hurts profits. Boeing, Carnivore, Centipede. Blue chip is on the hot list, but it's very expensive. Centipede is cyclical. Large construction machinery builder. Benefited from building surge. Recession may hurt. Yo, what's up, Taiki? I think I'm winning. Yeah. We're up so far. Cryer! Speculative stock. Received low interest government loans, which helped the company back to profitability. Got it, got it, got it. Kaufman! Florida's number one home builder. Oh, it's Kaufman and Broad. <laughs> Good. Excon Rail. Now a railroad leader looking to expand into other territories. That's a growth stock. That one's a growth stock. Maybe we grab this. So what was what was a blue chip? AT and T was a blue chip. Priscilla. I cannot live another day without air conditioning. Yesterday you said you'd call Shears. <laughs> you call now. <laughs> yeah. Is this Charles Schlob? It is. Very good. Large discount securities brokerage firm bought back by its founder. Recently experiencing much success. Should we buy some Charles Schlob? It's a growth stock, which is up right now. I think we buy some Schlob. <laughs> Thank you, Priscilla, for the dollar do. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm buying Charles Schlob. Here I go. I can afford 13. I'm not going to buy 13. I'm going to buy like seven. And then we'll buy, uh, we'll spend the rest on shit that's on like the top of the list. So like American Depress. I can afford three of these. I'm happy with this. Picnic! Picnic with woman! That sounds like a wonderful idea. We'll have a lovely two hours. And then let's go swimming as well. I don't know if we have time. Or maybe we can go to the gym. Good decision. Working out is very good for your health. Okay, so... We have until 17... 1700 hours every day. Picnic takes two, swimming takes two, shopping takes four, gym takes four. So it's just like time management then. <laughs> four hours at the gym is insane. All right, next day. Streaming? I don't think that'll ever catch on. No, you can't, as. Thank you for the two years of prime gaming. Looks like time advances on its own as we sit here. So when it hits 1,700 hours, okay, it just cuts to the next day. Like, by itself. Wall Street times. Economy. Interest rates have dropped by half a percent. 
Rising stocks outpaced by blue chip and growth stocks. Yeah, we're still up. Who's hot? American Depressed, Fired Men's, YBM, Xerox, Rebucks. Rattel is gone entirely. Uh, all the... There's no Pan Mam. The Pan Mam stock is not working out. Unless we really want to hold on to it and just pray that it hits later. <laughs> Maybe we should buy some Fired Men's Fund. Maybe we should. What am I holding? You gotta hold? I think we hold the Pan Mam. I think we hold those. They're they're 23 right now. They're both, uh, it's not going great. Everything else that we're holding is up. By some small amount. This Pan Mam, these Pan Mam stocks, they're gonna hit, dude. Eventually, they're gonna hit. <laughs> I can feel it. It's all upside, yeah. It's so, it was so cheap to buy, it's gotta go up. It has to. Carnival? Carnival takes the whole day, doesn't it? Sorry, honey, I'd get sick if I went on any rides today. So that takes the whole day. And I think hiking also takes the whole day. But I think you have to take it at like 9 o'clock, right when the day starts. We waited an hour, and we lost our chance. So I guess we're going back to the gym. Just back to the gym. That's all we do, is we buy and sell stocks, and we work out, and we go on picnics. <laughs> that is my life right now. Alright, next day. Oh, we went up! Wall Street Times, right, right. Interest rates have dropped by half a percent. Dude, we're so up. Rising stocks outpaced by... Okay, so the market data, that stays where it is for like a month. Or for like a week. American Depressed Firedman's Rebucks YBM Xerox. Poisonous insects raiding picnic grounds. Oh my god. Do you want to go to a picnic? Would you like to go to a picnic? I heard about some really sick poisonous insects. Honey, how could you even think I'd want to go there today? Didn't you read the morning paper? All right, fair enough. I just wanted to see what would happen. Look, I was joking. Do you want to go shopping? You'll forget all about this blunder. Brilliant. Oh, it's all right. We got her back. We got her back, baby. <laughs> It's just that easy. Distract her with shopping. <laughs> we lost 50 relationship points. It's okay. We bought her some nice things. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. It's fine. It's all good. Charles Schlob. Is it 36? It started at 34. We have a very, very slight profit. You got a good feeling about Yapple? So do I. I think Yapple's gonna take off at some point. Welcome to the Fantasy Zone. Get ready. Yo, Mikhail, thank you for the follow. They're very competitive with YBM. YBM is much more expensive. Stray Hound? Speculative stock Strayhound. Once a major bus line, sold the division in order to manufacture primarily okay. consumer products. Good. Excellent. What is Terra dying? Acquisitions have been made to strengthen the company. However, they still show losses. They are down 18%. Alright. We're just gonna keep it moving, I think. We're just gonna smash cut to the next day. We only went up 8,000. Still blue chip and growth stocks. Hot stocks, American Depress. AT&T is on the up and up. YBM Xerox. What's out? Something is out that wasn't before. Should we buy some AT&T if they're on the up? 
Should we get some A? Oh, it's Rebux. Yeah, it's gone, dude. Space expedition set for early next year. Life support station to be built on Plutosos. If only. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, the music loop's still going. Do I want to buy some AT&T while they're on the rise? They started at $62, now they're at $74. I wish we had bought AT&T earlier. It's rough. It's rough. I'm just gonna hold on to what I've got, I think. It's gonna hold- I'm just gonna gra- I'm just gonna clasp all the stonks that I'm holding firm to my chest. So that's all I'm gonna do. Go on a picnic. Go to Papa Trunks. Go picnic, go swimming. Swimming good for health. If you neglect your relationship or your health, you still game over, so you have to spend time on these things. Are we winning? Yeah, we started at half a million dollars. Now we're at almost 700,000. It's not going too bad. I'm confused, is Priscilla a stock? <laughs> is my fiancé a stock? Technically, we are investing, yeah. <laughs> We've not seen any uh, returns yet. But we certainly are throwing money into a fire. Oh, we're up! Let's go, dude! Interest rates dropping while prices remain stable. Blue chip and growth stocks. Firedman's Fund, American Depress, AT&T. Rebux is back! Xcon Rail on the up and up. Poisonous insects continue to raid the picnic grounds. No picnics today. Who the hell's calling? Hi, honey! My car is old and broken down. I need a new one. Okay, I'll go and look at some tomorrow. I'm about to get- how, how expensive is this car about to be, dude? Thanks, honey! Bye! This is about to be a pricey-ass car, are you kidding me? 20k? Maybe I should sell a stock. Maybe I should sell a stock just so I can afford this fucking car I'm about to have to buy. I will sell one stock of Pan Mam. Just one, and I'll hold the other six. That way, if the car costs 20k, I can afford the damn car. And, uh, I guess we, we're just gonna hit the gym. Hit the gym, baby. <laughs> yeah, Priscilla attacks. Next day. Car shopping! How may I help you? Hello, Cal. I'd like to purchase a car as a gift to my fiancé. I have a Ferrari for 50k, a BMV for 25,000, bruh, 50k? I'm sorry, I don't got that kind of money. You're getting the shitty car, I'm sorry. You're just gonna have to deal. It's got like two doors, it's got like the roll-up windows. <laughs> you gotta roll it up manually. Good choice. I'm sure she'll like it. Oh, password. All right, uh, I will save this state right here. There we go. Scoliotage! Honey, I don't even drive. <laughs> I don't even drive! Marry me with Not the IRS! Money. Hello, Mr. Dino. Mm -hmm. We're a small upstart company looking for someone to invest in our products. Mm -hmm. And we think you're just the guy we need. Tell me more. What's our product, you may ask? Well, eh, uh, we... Yeah. Sell cool raccoon t-shirts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what we sell. I'd buy. I'll take your entire stock. That's fine. Yeah, thank you for the dollar redo. Thank you, Scolionich, for the 100 bits. I'll tell you what fucks me up about these passwords is it has, like, inverse color scheme characters as well. Like, why are the... Why is the question mark... Why is the percent sign? Why is it, like, inverse... And, like, I, it's fine, 
But imagine you have to write this down on a piece of paper. How do you even write that? <laughs> it's like, what? Like, I'd be cooked trying to write this down. Am I up? I'm not sure. Economy. Interest rates have risen by 0.5%. Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Wasn't Pan Mam speculative? Is our Pan Mam stock hitting? Oh, baby. Are we back? Are we so back? Hot stocks. Fireman's Fund. Crier. Rebucks International. Terra Dying. Stray Hound. Okay, so if speculative and... Okay, okay, okay. There have been reports of dangerously defective chemicals being sold to all pool owners. Oh no. Who the hell? Hello, this is Ralph. Larry just told me that you must purchase the house by May 1st. Okay. No. The house is still for sale, and I can take you by the house on Saturday to close the deal. Bruh, I don't got a million dollars. Remember, if you don't have the cash on Saturday, you won't have another chance at the house. Do we have a deal? No, not at the moment. All right. If the house is still up for sale in a week, I'll call you then to see if you're ready to buy. It's not important. We got time. It's only it's the 17th. We got time. Let me check that paper again. What kind of stocks are up? Speculative and growth stocks are up. We still have stocks in American Depress, right? That's a growth stock. Let me see if the let me see if this Pan Mam stock is hitting. Pan Mam is at 23 still. It hasn't hit yet, <clears throat> but our other shit must have hit. I've got enough money for... Let me see what I'm holding, first of all. I'm holding Pan Mam, I'm holding Charles Schlob. I've got American Depress. This is up... Tremendously. American Depress is up a shit ton. Charles Schlob... <laughs> it's up very slightly. Yeah, the number go up experience. I'm... Wondering if I should get something else with this, because there was some other shit that was on, like, the leaderboard. Like, Stray Hound was on there. Maybe Welcome we could get some panel. Stray Keep Hound. Get ready. Mouse Gills, thank you for the follow. Are we making mad money? Not on these Charles Schlob stonks, that's for sure. I'm gonna sell these ones. I'm gonna keep the Pan Mam. And then, so let me check the fucking... I gotta keep checking the paper to see, like, the... What's hot... What's hot? Fireman's Fun Crier Rebucks Terra Dying Stray Hound. Okay. We can buy more <laughs> pan, ma'am. I'm tempted to get some Rebucks. Maybe some Crier stocks? Mmm. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. How much do these go for? Cryer is at 50 bucks. Rebucks 43. Strayhound 58. Rebucks might be a good purchase. Let's go Rebucks. Invest in the shoe market. <laughs> I'm filthy stinking uh, poor. $666,000 in stocks. That's pretty... That's pretty good. Now that I have a car, is it possible to take a loan? Nice to see you again. Which service can I provide you with today? I need a loan. I'm sorry, I cannot process your loan if you have no collateral to apply against it. Do I have to buy the house first? Do we get the house and then we get a loan with the house? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I thought I could use the car as collateral. Alas. Well, we still have time, so swimming? I should have paid closer attention to the morning paper. What did it say? <laughs> Something- oh, it was right, pool chemicals, that's right. We just got so many diseases. 
Let's go on a picnic. <laughs> Dangerous chemicals. Wall Street Kid is now purple. <laughs> oh, we're up! Wall Street Times. Higher prices keep interest rates climbing. Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Fireman's Fund Crier. American Depressed Teradyne Rebucks is up. Let's fucking go, dude. Pan Mam has not hit yet. <laughs> At some point, it's got to hit. Dangerously defective chemicals being sold to all pool owners. Okay. Tell you what. Let's go shopping with woman. That takes four hours. We cannot go swimming today. Tomorrow, we have to go, like, to the gym or something. We gotta go to, like, the gym tomorrow. Pan Mam is still at 24. That's right where we purchased it at. At some point, it's gonna hit. It's got to hit. It has to. There's no way this plan backfires. Absolutely zero. <laughs> American Depress. Should we sell? They're still up, though. They're up to 92? I feel like we need to sell these soon. Tell you what. American Depress is at 92 right now. If at any point we see that go lower than 92, maybe we get rid of it, or maybe it just keeps climbing. Maybe. Maybe. Sell one or two? If we sell one, we can afford more of some other shit for sure. I mean, it's up like 30 bucks on what it was. I will sell just one. Just one. And then, what was in the... What was in the newspaper? Terra Dying. I saw the name Terra Dying as, like, a stock that was up. I can afford three of these. Let's get some of these. It's got the word dying in it, which does not instill confidence in any way. But it's cheap. So, we're at 691,000 in stocks right now. Skip to next day. Are we up? 705, let's go! Wall Street Times. Higher prices keep interest rates climbing. Speculative and growth stocks climb, others crash. Cryer, Fireman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks, Excon Rail. More giant cockroaches invade the South Seas Island. Giant cans of Rado used without success. Okay, we have to go to the gym before we neglect our character and he fucking dies. Discussion Salsa! They were the 52 whole years. Let me check my stonks. What's my, what's my shit at? Hold on, wait. Nope, portfolio. Nope, wrong one. Portfolio. American Depress is still climbing. They're at 96. Terra Dying is... Well, I just bought that, so it's the same as it was. Rebucks is up a couple dollars. If I have six stocks in Rebucks right now. If Rebucks keeps climbing, it'll be very valuable. I feel like American Depress is about to drop. I feel like they're gonna... They're, that's not gonna continue. <laughs> You'd get out if it hits $100. I think that's pretty smart. That's probably wise. This investment in Pan Mam is, it has not worked out so far, but once it hits, that shit's gonna hit. You know, if it ever hits. Picnic. What if it goes higher than 100? All I've gotten out of this stream so far is that I should not do this in real life. I, w I would be so bad. Oh shit, we're up, dude! We're up to 727. Hot stocks cry or terror dying. Pan Mam Airlines, we're so back! Poisonous insects raiding picnic grounds. We're so back, dude. 
We're unbelievably back. I've never been so back in my whole life. They're currently at $25. What if they go up again? American Depress is at 98. Rebux is up. Terra Dying is up. Dude, everything is up. Everything's up. I don't want to do anything today. Number go up, dude. Picnic. Picnic with girl. Honey, how could you even think I'd want to go there today? Didn't I read the paper? No. I skimmed it. Well, I was, I was just kidding. I was just kidding. Look, listen, let's go shopping. We'll forget you. We'll just forget all about it. It's fine. It's fine. We won her back. With frivolous uh, purchases. Plus 30! We went from 727 to 757! Interest rates have risen. Oh, dude, we're cooking. Yo, what's up, Ghost Pilot? Hot Stocks Bulletin Crier, Fired Mint, Teradyne, Pan Mam, Stray Hound. Prince Lopa Loco heading to, uh, going to marry American heiress combined worth over 75 billion dollars. Okay, we have to go to the gym. Takes four hours. Itadaki Street. Well, that also came out how many decades after this game? <laughs> Let's see here. Pan Mam's at 26. It does continue to grow. Not very many. I mean, even if it's one decade after. <laughs> Rebucks is still good. Oh yeah, it's true. American Depress hit 101. That's probably wise. We should get out of this. We should get out of this one while it's up, right? We should get out of this one. And then try to get some more cheap shit because if we buy a shit ton of shares in the cheap shit, then it basically like multiplies the gains that we would get, right? We could get more pan ma'am. It's still pretty cheap. And if Pan Mam is on the up and up, if it continues to climb, then it'd like multiply our gains, really. I'm gonna get more. I'm gonna get more Pan Mam. This could backfire massively. I have zero dollars. That's all my money. All my money, it's in the stock market. I have fake fictional money right now. I see no way this backfires. I think we're good. Next day. My password! Alright, let's save. Uh, save state. There we go. Yeah, invest in the new yen. 760. I think it went up, like, very slightly. Blue chip and speculative stocks swim above the drowners. I think Pan Mam is a speculative stock. Hot Stocks, Cryer, Strayhound, Teradyne, Pan Mam, Bethlehem, Steel. The art world goes into shock as a Warholski print goes up for sale for $400 million. Hello, it's Ralph. The house is still for sale. I think you should strongly consider buying this time, or your time will be up. I can take you by the house on Saturday. We can conclude the deal. This is probably the last chance that we have to say yes to this, so I feel like we probably should. Good choice. I'm sure you'll love the house. I'll see you on Saturday. Don't forget the cash! I'm sure it'll be fun. So we have Rebuck's stock. Rebuck is a growth stock, which are not up right now. We should sell these. Terra dying was speculative, and then the rest is all in Pan Mam. <laughs> Buy the house with exposure, yeah. Let me check the paper again. I gotta check the paper, hold on. I forgot who's up. Blue chip and speculative stocks. 
right? Crier Strayhound Terra Dying. Pan Man Bethlehem Steel. How much can I buy those for? Let's see. Let's make some purchases. Bethlehem's 48, Cryer is 64. Bethlehem is allegedly on the up and up, but it changed 0% today. I can buy five of these. I'm gonna buy these. I see no way this plan backfires. Oh, can I afford another one? Oh, my portfolio's full! I got too much pan, ma'am! I'm sure it's fine. Picnic! To the picnic! Yeah, portfolio is full. I can only hold five at a time. Let's see, are we up or are we down? We went up a very tiny amount. Interest rates have risen by half a percent. YBM, Xerox, Boeing, AT&T, Cryer. Okay. Okay, okay. Up-and-coming video software company hits it big with a high-stakes game soon to be number one. We may have to ditch. Let's see. Pan Mam's at what? They're still at 26. No, no, no. We still gained money. It was just a very small amount. Considering that we bought these Pan Mam stocks for 24 and 25, respectively, we haven't lost anything on them. The other ones are still up. Terra Dying is up. More than Bethlehem is. <laughs> yeah, Casino Kid. Casino Kid is a very fun time. Can I afford more Pan Mam? I cannot. Not allowed. I'm going to the gym. Working out's very good for your health. Transaction takes four hours. Next day. Wait, I still have time. Picnic! We go on picnics a lot. Surely there's, like, better activities for a couple to be doing. Just picnics every day. Okay, we're still up. Xerox, Cryer, YBM, Terra Dying, Strayhound. Yeah, only stonks and picnics. Space Expedition, set for early next year. Life Support Station to be built on Plutosos. Okay, okay, okay. Pan Mam is at 27 now. That honestly might be about as high as that one's gonna get. It is gaining, but, like, slowly. Perhaps too slowly. The gambling allegations? Don't be silly. Name one time I've ever gambled on this show. Alright, we're gonna ditch these now. And then we're gonna put them into some other shit that's in the paper. We still got a good profit out of all of those. 3,000? Jesus Christ, no. Okay. <laughs> Bellatro Wheel of Fortune. To be fair, Wheel of Fortune I was peer pressured into. Bethlehem is not as up as Terra Dying is, but that's fine. Check this paper. Check the paper real quick. Who's up? Xerox, Cryer, YBM, Terra Dying, Strayhound. Right, right, right. Strayhound is 69. Bethlehem, 50. YBM is way too much. Xerox is way too much. Do we go with the meme Strayhound because it's $69? That feels like a sound financial investment. Oh, we've already sold our Pan Mam, it's fine. 
I obviously we gotta go. We gotta go with the sixty-nine dollar. Hit the gym. Next day. We should probably go shopping tomorrow with the fiance. 20k. I don't think we're gonna have enough to buy this house at this rate. Let's see who's climbing. Xerox, Cryer, YBM, Teradyne, Pan Mam again. Prince Lopo Loco, yes. I'm gonna look at Pan Mam. It's gonna be at like $35 now that we've sold it. <laughs> I can absolutely see this happening. 28. Let's see here. What am I holding? No, 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 no. Portfolio. Everything that we're holding is up. Not by, like, a lot, but they're all up. This house is a million dollars, yeah. Well, there's not much else to do today. Let's try and have some faith into the... Try and have some faith in the stocks we've got. Let's see. Still have time to go for a swim. I don't know if we can make that much money fast enough. Up another 25. Like, we're on the up and up, just like, slowly. But we need to be on the up and up swiftly. That's the problem. Another ga uh, another gangster shoot up at a downtown tavern after big brawl. No injuries <laughs> reported. Hello, this is Ralph. Just calling to remind you not to forget the one million dollars cash. See you tomorrow. We might be boned. I don't think we can make a million that quick. <laughs> Sell everything, gamble on a dip praying for the rise. That's true. We don't have a better plan. That is true. I mean, if we need to make a million in that time frame... We pretty much gotta just buy, put all of our stocks in, like, one basket. Actually, maybe that's just how you play this game in general, right? Maybe you're supposed to just put all your eggs in one basket. This is Ralph, reminding you to not forget the fucking money tomorrow. See ya. <laughs> yeah, I Bring will. Your dog. <laughs> I will break your legs. Thank you, Tepid Snake. Yo, what's up, Mikey? Let's see. Pan Mam is at 29. What are we what are we scheming on? We could buy a shit ton of uh We could just buy more Pan Mam. We could spend I could buy 28 Pan Mams and then if it goes up again. If it goes up to like 31, we'd have a shit ton of money. <laughs> like maybe that's the play, because it's still on the up according to the paper. I'm gonna do it. Here I go. Good morning. I've been working very hard on this deal, holding the house from other buyers. He's been beating people to death with machetes that are trying to buy the house. He's just on the front doorstep. <laughs> Now I hear you don't have enough cash. How irresponsible. I'm afraid the deal is off. Ralph has just informed me that you failed to buy the house. Too bad. If you can't even make enough profit from a free half million dollar gift to buy a house, you'll never make it as a Benedict. Game's over. That's all right. Here's the good news. We know that Pan Mam goes up, right? So if we just back up to the password screen, we just back up to, like, right here. Instead of having to fucking put in the password again. <laughs> now Ban Map crashes in value. It's true, there could be, like, randomness to this. Yeah, time powers activate. 
I find that it's probably wise to do it this way, as opposed to, like, trying to fucking put in the password for an hour. Yes. See you on Saturday, don't forget the money. That's true, it could- <laughs> I wonder if that does happen, Kid. It could be. Cheating at Stonk Races? How am I cheating? I just backed up to the password screen. Alright, sell everything that's not pan, ma'am. Here I go. It's only 26 bucks right now. All I have is Pan Mam stocks. That's my whole portfolio. <laughs> it's so stupid, but what if it works? All right, shopping. Swimming. Frog race has been redeemed. Let's see if this fucking stonk goes up. No gains today. It stayed right where it was. So there probably is some degree of randomness here, then. Have we been to the carnival? No. We could do that today, maybe. Carnival. Let's do it. That sounds good. Let's have a fun day. <laughs> it takes the whole day. My money went up very slightly. I mean, it's not like we had anything else to do that day. Hollywood's talk show hosts make waves as they battle for overseas rating points. Okay. Let's go hiking. Good decision. Hiking is very good for your health and state of mind. Transaction takes eight hours. Next day. 812? I still don't think we're gonna make enough money fast enough. We might have to back up, like, all the way. Yeah, the hiking transaction. <laughs> transaction hiking. <laughs> Pan Mam's on the up. Yeah, back when it was like $23, it was really cheap at, at, at the start. It sure was. Next day. 841. What's my advice on getting the bag? I don't know. I mean, we started with half a million dollars. We've only gained money. The problem is you have to gain money faster than this. Not to forget the one million dollars cash. The stock only go up. Alright, fair enough. We've got a greater grasp on what we're doing. So let's back this up from the start of April, and maybe we could make money faster in the long run. Instead of backing up like a week. But before we do that, we have to do the frog race. So let's do that first. Do you know... Rahi? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Very good. Place your bets. Finally, gambling, but for me! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> you bet with your chest. I wish you nothing but good fortune. Windfish favored at 30%. Lahi, not too far behind. Best of luck, everyone. Oh, frog number one, frog number three. Everyone's playing catch up. He stops at the line though. Lahi gets there first. It's a photo finish, I can't believe it. Pay it out to frog number one. That was insane. Unbelievable. 546,000 new yen given to 34 lucky winners. Congratulations to the 34 of you that have claimed victory. My condolences to the probably 100 or so other bettors that did not. That's all right. Just like in Wall Street, kid, where you're just going to have to run that back. All right, let's back this all the way up. Let's back this all the way up, and let's adopt a new strategy this time. Instead of buying a shit ton of all the stocks, what if we put all of our eggs in one basket at a time? I may regret this strategy. Yeah, what if we just go all in all the time? That way, when a stock really hits, we get big, huge money out of it. I'm thinking maybe that's wise. Did we reset? Yeah, we lost. Did you not see the bit where we lost, or... Do you watch the stream? <laughs> a poem's been redeemed. Alright, let's do that first. Hey, Stampede. How about a poem? I'm silver smooth. Bathe ten times a second in an aerosol fire. Five thousand degrees in here. I course with electricity from my feet to my tongue, where I vomit a torque delivering spark. Yes. To be clear, we did nothing but gain money. We just didn't gain enough money. <laughs> At no point were we in the red. We just have to gain money faster than that, that's all. Speculative and growth stocks climb. Who's up? Firedman's Fun, Crier, Rebucks, Terra Dying, Stray Hound. Here's what I'm thinking. I think that we grab a bunch of whichever of these five stonks are the cheapest. That way, when there is profit, we get the biggest, most dramatic gains. That's what I'm thinking. Another gangster shoot up at a downtown tavern after big brawl. No injuries reported. No, I do not want to buy a house right now. I only have half a mil, my dude. <laughs> Invest in Thompson machine guns. <laughs> buy stocks. What are we doing here? Cryer is only 49. Firedman's. Strayhound. Terra Dying. I've already forgotten the other one. I'm tempted to get some Cryer. Tempted to get some Cryer right now. Just go all in on Yapple. Was it Rebucks? I think that's right. Rebucks is the cheapest out of all of these. We could go all in on Rebucks. For now, I can buy 12 of these. I can afford nothing more than this. Go shopping. Four hours. I still have some time. Let's go swimming. That's all we do is we go swimming, and then we have picnics, and then we do the stock market. That's the life of Wall Street, kid. It's very... It's very not great. Yeah, he's living the life, is he? YBM was up over a hundred bucks. Let's see what we got here. Terra Dying, Fireman, Cryer, American Depress, Rebucks, still up there. Giant cockroaches invade the island. <laughs> yeah, 
eat, picnic, and lie. That's all he does, dude. American Depress is at 67. Rebucks is up. YBM is at 203 right now. It started at 215. YBM is actually down. If we wanted to do the biggest brain play ever in history, we could grab a couple YBMs, and then when they hit, they really hit. <laughs> we could hit them while they're- we could buy them while they're sinking, and then it'll carry us in the future. That's the worst idea ever, but it's just crazy enough to work, I feel. We've already- we've already profited on the Rebucks, because they went up a dollar. Yo, what's up, dude? Here I go. I can buy YBM while they're tanking. I can only afford two of these. That's good! And then let's grab some, uh... Let's see. I can't afford much else. I can get some Pan Mam. <laughs> yeah, Dormammu, I've come to bargain. Let's get some Kaufman, because they're also down. I'm gonna look at my bankroll tomorrow, and it's gonna say that I've dipped to, like, 300k. <laughs> it's gonna be completely bankrupt is the worst plan. Going to the gym. Next day. Right, it went down. But that's because uh, YBM is a blue chip stock, so we need to pretty much wait until blue chip stocks go up, and then we'll make bank from this. In theory. The <laughs> stock market is piss easy. That's all you gotta do is just like, click on things with your little mouse cursor. And then you click on the flower pot, you go shopping with your fiancé. That's all that it really is, the stock market. There's not a whole lot to it. <laughs> That's good. I cannot move diagonally, by the way. If I want to go diagonally, I have to zigzag like this. <laughs> We're continuing to tank. This is probably gonna continue until, like, next week, when the types of stocks that go up changes. I don't foresee a whole lot happening in the meantime. Yo, thanks for tuning in, Dubstep Paladin. The diagonal movement wasn't invented yet. Hope we make it big. Nothing so far. Nothing's happened so far. We're not going to see any major changes until next week. So as long as we don't lose too much in the meantime, it's probably fine. Yes, buy the dog. How much was the better car? It was like 50k, right? Maybe we don't buy her a car. Maybe we tell her to take the bus. We're, we'll, we're gonna be divorced before we fail from not buying a house. Tell her to take a hike. It takes all day, dude. I will buy the poodle. You know what? I'm buying a chihuahua. Shiny cover for her bus pass. True. I think we're up a few dollars. Blue chip and speculative stocks swim above the drowners. Cryer, Stray Hound, Terra Dying, Pan Mam, Bethlehem Steel. Poisonous insects raiding the picnic grounds. No, I do not want to buy a house yet. I will wait. No, sir. I'm holding. 
I'm holding my shit, dude. <laughs> exactly one million dollars. That's just how it works. Okay, we're up. So what are we hoping for? We're hoping that YBM hits, right? Pretty much. YBM is up! If I say Wall Street Kid's a visual novel, no. No, I wouldn't. I would say it's a stonks sim. <laughs> oh shit, was there poisonous insects at the picnic? Ah shit, ah dicks. I'm sorry, let's go shopping instead. Kaufman has not gone back up. We might be, uh... We may regret that. That stock. There are a lot of Japanese games like this. Correct. Is shopping the only safe bet? Probably not, because there's, like, occasionally, like, gangster shootouts in the news. That's probably your incentive to not go shopping that day, if I had to guess. Let me sell the Kaufmans, just so that I have room to, uh, buy some other things that might be on the up. I don't have a whole lot of, uh money. It did say that Pan Mam was up from the, what, 26 it started at? I can't believe Pan Mam's at 31 now, but when we really needed it to hit earlier, <laughs> we could not get that kind of luck. Love a good stonks game, yeah! Let me check the paper. I don't know who's up right now. Read the news. Here I go. Crier, YBM, Xerox. Let's get some Crier stonks. I can only afford one. That'll have to do. Next day. Only 18,000 in profit. I feel like you need pretty substantial gains. Extremely swiftly in this. Which does lead me to believe that you need to buy a lot of cheap stocks instead of a small amount of expensive ones. But YBM does continue to climb. I have enough money to get a very cheap stonk. I'll buy one pan, ma'am. Yeah, asset allocation, that's pretty much... I've got $500 left. Let's go, dude. Twenty K. Not the worst. Blue chip speculative stonks swim above the drowners. Cryer, Strayhound, YBM, Xerox, Terra dying. Another gangster shoot up at a downtown tavern after big brawl. No injuries reported. Let's test the theory that when there's a shoot up downtown, that we shouldn't go shopping. Let's test this theory. Brilliant idea. You know how I love to shop. Never mind. She's not deterred at all by the shootout. We must live in New York. My password- uh, you know, I should save this password, just in case. We only went up 8,000. Blue chip cyclical stocks surpass others. I think YBM is a blue chip. Boeing, Carnivore, American Depress, Rattel. 
Firedman's Fund. I do not want to purchase the house. No, sir. No deal. She was hyped to see dead bodies, yeah. Let's sell our crier, which we did profit on. We'll sell this and we'll sell our pan man. Let's get some uh let's get some carnivore. Yeah, I can afford three of these. There we go. That feels good. That feels right. Go to the gym. There is a simple number go up to this that is very therapeutic. Oh shit, was there insects? My bad. Ah, you'll be fine. She'll get over it, probably. Blue chip cyclical stocks. Rattel, Carnivore, Kaufman and Broad, Marinot Hotels. <laughs> I didn't even notice Marinot. <laughs> Yeah, the murder cloud at the carnival. I'm going to the carnival right now. That sounds good. Let's have a fun day. Okay. Stream dead? No. <laughs> Just buy her a new car. Local hero to be given ticker tape welcome after saving drowning guinea pig. Give him the key to the city, dude. What a guy. Welcome to the Ooh, that one hit. Get ready. That one hit. That was 25k. Dark Side Mystic, thank you for the follow. Did we get that house? No. That's the first, like, big wall of the game. You have to make, like, a million dollars fast enough. We've not figured out how to do that yet. But YBM does keep climbing. How much did we buy YBM for? We bought YBM for 203, and it's up to 255. So it's... I mean, it's steadily rising. <laughs> It might pay off. I don't know if we can make enough money with that fast enough, but I guess we'll just keep uh, doing activities in the meantime. Because it's not like we have enough money to buy different stocks. Another 25k. At the rate we're going, it won't be enough. Unless YBM hits a huge, like, spike, which could be cool. My car is old and broken down. I need a new one. Okay, I'll go and look at some tomorrow. I'm absolutely not buying you a car. There is no world in which I purchase you a car, I'm sorry. How may I help you? I'd like to purchase a car as a gift to my fiance. I have a Ferrari for 50k, a BMV for 25k. Nah, I'm good, keep him. Come back again. I'll be more than happy to help you. So you just don't have to buy, huh? You just don't have to? That's huge. <laughs> She's gonna break up with me, yeah. The house is still for sale. Speedrunners don't buy her anything. Yeah, we have to take it on, uh... We have to try to get the house on the 24th. That's, like, our deadline. But still, I don't think we can make enough money quick enough unless we sell YBM now, which gives us a lot of money to get a different... Uh, a bunch of different stocks. And then we hope that they all hit at the same time.
Hi, hello. This game is simplified but it still tracks. Mm. The first million is the hardest and people with single digit millions tend to have the same problems as anyone else but at a much greater scale since many don't live under means. Ah. Anyhow, all in pan ma'am. All in pan ma'am. We could go all in on one of these. We could go all in on American Depress, Rebucks. We could go all in on Boeing. That seems like a very bad idea. <laughs> For you, chat room, anything. Oh, Boeing is too expensive, though. We want, like, a lot of stocks. Let's go all in on American Depress. Yeah, Boeing is... Boeing is expensive. I still have enough money to buy a little more, yeah. Stocks, question mark? Yes. Did you see the stream title, by any chance? There were context clues. <laughs> Okay. 678? I don't think this is gonna work out. Space expedition set for early next year. Just remember, chat room. 1991? I don't know when 1991 is gonna be. But, uh, life support station on Pluto. Get hyped for that. Can't wait. It was a brighter future, yeah. The... <laughs> the visions of the future, of the past, were so much more hopeful. <laughs> it's it's charming. We got a huge profit, that one. This That one hit big. I still don't think we get there in time, though. Just go next day. 36 thousand dollar profit. Yeah, it's not gonna be enough money fast enough. I do think it's the right strat though to like put all your eggs in one basket. I think that's kinda what the meta of this game might be. Because we have six stocks in American Depress, and since it's up fifteen dollars, fifteen times six. Whereas if we spread it out, yeah, if we spread it out where it's just, you're gonna have less profit when your shit hits. I think that's what this game is kind of steering us towards. I think that's how the game wants you to play it. No, this stream is not financial advice. Alright, we don't got the million dollars, so let's take this new strategy back to the beginning. Oh, that's a good sound. Oh, thank god. <laughs> well, like, why does resetting the game hold the note that it was on? Alright. Now we have a strategy. Now we've got a strategy. We just kind of pick one, and then we roll with it. E. <laughs> Save stating, nah. I would only save state on the password screen. Alright, blue chip and cyclical stocks surpass the others. Boeing, Carnivore, American Depress, Rattel Toys, Firedman's Fund, 
Do we go all in on Retail Toys? Do we go all in on American Depress? Muggers are becoming regular customers at the shopping. Ah, that's the one that tells you not to go shopping. That's the one. Buy a lot of each hot stock category, sell every week to rebuy new categories. That is probably wise, yeah. American Depressed is 65. I think Carnivore was up. I gotta ch I already forgot. What's up? I thought Rattel Toys was on there. I literally already forgot. Blue Chip and Cyclical Stocks. Boeing Carnivore Cruise Lines. American Depressed Rattel Toys. Firedman's Fund. Rattel Toys is tempting. I'm tempted to get some Rattel Stocks. Only 35? I can hold 14 of these bad boys? Here I go. I may regret that. But when it profits, all of my stocks profit, so that could be good. Honey, didn't you read the morning paper? I'm not going near the shopping mall. I just wanted to see what she would say. <laughs> I just wanted to see what she'd say. Interest rates are dropping while prices remain stable. No, Sly Dante, your eyes are playing tricks on you. Something else happened. Retail Toys number one, baby! Let's fucking go! Alright, now we actually have to go shopping with the fiancé. I can't believe Crumpton's fucking dead. <laughs> Alright, we went swimming. Let's see if Rattel continues to climb. Rattel is climbing! Interest rates have dropped by 0.5%. Carnivore Cruise Lines, Rattel Toys, still the number two stock right now. Boeing, YBM, ZRox. Gymnasium under investigation by the health department. What the hell's going on in that gym? Let's go swimming instead. Go swimming? Go for a picnic? Let's check our portfolio. How's Rattel doing? Rattel's up to 39. So just it going up $4 has given us $50,000. The profits when you just put all the eggs in one basket is like so massive that that's probably what speedrunners do. I'm assuming. <laughs> Let's see. We went up again. Oh, dude, we're filthy stinking rich. Do we just hold Rattel toys until the end of the week? I think we hold Rattel until the end of the week, and then we get, like, the new hot thing. Another gangster shoot-up at a downtown tavern after Big Brawl. I think that's what we do. Eighty-three-year-old woman comes in first in the annual USA Marathon. Now wanted for a Channel 3 sports show. Good for her. Yeah, you absolutely love to see that type of thing happen. So Rattel is up to 43. Nice, nice. Next day. Oh, let me save right here. We've been saving state on the password screen in order to, uh... ...juke the ritual of having to put it in. <laughs> I 
Rising stocks are outpaced by blue chip and growth stocks. Retail was a cyclical stock and not a blue chip or a growth stock, so we need to swap here. Firedman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks, Boeing, Carnival Cruise Lines. Hollywood's talk show hosts make waves as they battle for overseas rating points. No, I do not want to buy the house yet. I do not have a million dollars, sir. No, this is just stonks, yeah, this is a stonks game. Okay. Now is the time to sell Retail Toys. We got a hundo out of that. I think that was worth. We need to check the paper. Because I already forgot. <laughs> Let's see. Blue chip and growth stocks are the best ones right now. Firedman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks, Boeing, Carnival. Carnivore, rather. Buy stocks. American Depress is at 69. What did it start at? Carnivore is at 46. Scolionage, they were the 42 all years. Rebucks. I think Rebucks was on there. Maybe we get some Rebucks. Maybe Rebucks is about to go crazy. I love this plan. This song's making you go insane. I'll turn it down a bit. There you go. Now you're alone with mostly my voice, your thoughts. And a very, very quiet theme song that will continue way in the back of your ear holes. We are the Wall Street kid, that's true. All right, next day. No profits whatsoever on Rebucks. Rebucks did not hit at all. American Depress, Firedman's Fund, YBM, Xerox, Rebucks International. It's still saying that Rebucks is a hot stock. And yet, it did not budge from where it was the day previous. Maybe we just keep holding on to it then. We just keep holding. I'd buy that for a dollar. Same. Go shopping. It profited by like one dollar because we went up sixteen. <laughs> It's now the number four stock. It only went up one dollar, but it's still on, like, the hot stocks leaderboard. Going to the gym. Yo, I count. Wall Street Skid. Skid. Avodico. Quasson. Avodico. Quasson. Does does he know how to say, like, any words correctly? She won another race. She's insane. Rebucks continues to climb steadily. Not, like, swiftly, but it's going. And yo. Mayo Cats. Merry Christmas. Thanks. Yo, thank you for the gift sub to Feltemp Reparatio. I might not have said that right. Thank you. Rebucks is off the leaderboard entirely. Mm. I hope it doesn't go back down. <laughs> I'm ruined if it goes back down, dude. Viscount. 
I need a hype steam locomotive. Steam locomotive. Love a good steam locomotive. I'm going to the gym again. Yeah, maybe we need to buy, like, the number two, number three. We can make that adjustment next week once it changes. I feel like it's a little late in the week to do it. We went up again. We went up, like, another two dollars. Yeah, because it's already Friday. We, we should probably wait. Fireman's Fund American Depressed. Rebux is back on here. It wasn't a bad purchase. Poisonous insects raiding picnic grounds. We have to buy the dog, right? Kaku Epsilon. I could say words correctly, but how would you know it's me? And how would you scam all those bits off of your fans? <laughs> Wait a tick. Thank you. I think for the 100 bits. Lamasar, I think for the 47 whole years. I don't like the notion of having fans, right? Something about that feels wrong. I just stream. <laughs> Five count. Equals three. Equals three. I've not seen that show in years. If I count, thank you for the 100 bits. Lamasar, thank you for the 47 whole years. Brad, thank you for the 100 bits. So after this... Yo, Jade! Just some bits for just some do. That's what I like to hear. Thank you. Thank you, Jade, for the 100 bits. Let's buy the poodle. We got the money. Fucking ball out. Wait, I gotta save on the password screen. There we go. So now we should probably sell, now that it's a new week. Interest rates have risen by 0.5%. Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Who's hot right now? Fireman's Fun, Crier, Rebucks. Well, that's a problem. We have Rebucks still. Do we continue to hold the Rebucks? <laughs> it like rolled the exact same one. Do I do I just keep holding Rebucks? I think we just I think we just hold on to it. This is Ralph. Larry told me you must purchase the house by May 1st. I'm gonna hold on to that Rebucks. Gonna keep those Rebucks stonks close to my chest. What if it- what if it shoots to the moon, dude? What if? I'm gonna go to the carnival. Let's have a fun day. All right, we're still up. Is there post-house gameplay? Well, if there is, we've not seen it yet. We gotta get there first. American Depressed Rebuck still the fifth. Should we switch to the Fireman's Fund? Mm -hmm. Local hero to be given ticker tape welcome after saving drowning guinea pig. Yeah, something about a castle we heard about at the start of the game. The good news is if we get the house, if we get the house, that means we can get a loan out on the house. And then with the money we get from taking the loan, we could probably get a ton more stocks, right? Presumably. But we got to get there first. <laughs> We're getting way ahead of ourselves. We haven't even made enough money to get the damn house yet. Up another dollar. <laughs> Blow it all on hats. Rebucks back up to number four. 
There have been reports of dangerously defective chemicals being sold to all pool owners. Not a problem. I will simply go to a carnival instead. Seven twenty, seven thirty six. Higher prices keep interest rates climbing. Pan Mam Airlines. The art world goes into shock. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Disregard pool acquired gym. You're right. Here I go. I will seek personal gains. Oh, that was a big hit. That was a big profit there. Interest rates have risen by 5% or 0.5%. Tick abundance attacks family on hiking grounds. Not the tick, dude. My car is old and broken down. I need a new one. I don't know. I don't know if I can... I don't know if I got room in the budget for a car. I don't know if I can do that. Tell you what. What if I go shopping for you right now? I'm gonna go shopping. Right? We're gonna go shopping. We're gonna go to a picnic. We're gonna do all these activities to distract you from the fact that I'm not buying you this car. Save password. Eh. 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 Okay. <laughs> yeah, it just came so over. I wouldn't be surprised. Blue chip speculative stocks swim above the drowners. Crier Strayhound, Terra Dying, Pan Mam Airlines, Bethlehem Steel. Changes the ending. I don't even know if we're getting to the ending. Let's just buy the number one stonk. Let's go all in on the number one stonk in the newspaper. Because we need to make a lot of money swiftly here. Alright, it's Crier. We're going all in on Crier. I can hold 12 of these. Next day. Right. You know someone who's trying to collect every single Wall Street kid cartridge? That's pretty good. It immediately tanked to number five on the Hot Stocks Bulletin. We're still not making money fast enough. We can pretty consistently gain money. It's just never at the rate that the game needs it to be. Yeah. We keep ending up at, like, mid 800,000s. We are ahead of our last run, but, like, the 28th is the last day that we're allowed to do shit on. Yeah, that's when we get the phone call. So there's gotta be a way to get even more money, even more faster. You were close. Yeah. We 
We can consistently profit, it's just never at a speed high enough. So the question is, how do we how do we make money faster? We know how to make money, it's just never fast enough. What is the strat? What is the get rich fast strat? That's what we need. Get only the first place stock. That's true, maybe we should. Maybe maybe we just buy the number one shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna buy I'm gonna go all in on number one as soon as I as soon as we get back in. Yeah, you start with half a million dollars, which is pretty fantastic. Problem is, we need to double that within a month. Wall Street Times. Gamble super hard, yeah. What's number one? Firedman's Fund. I'm going all in on Firedman's Fund. Buy stonks. Firedman's $69. Very good. Go shopping. Go shopping. Go swimming. Did we reset? I feel like every single time we go back, there's somebody that misses it. And it's like, did we go back? What happened? It's like there's constantly people going to the bathroom. Got no fucking clue what's going on. Just constantly, just every time. This <laughs> stream just started true. All right, 518? Who's number one now? Firedman's Fund is still at the number one slot. Let's go hiking. Hiking is very good for your health and state of mind. Transaction takes eight hours. It's a hell of a hike. 553, that's not bad at all. Now Terra Dying is the top stock. Do we switch to Terra Dying? Gymnasium under investigation by the health department. Firedman's Fund is up 10 bucks on where it started. I'm very pleased with that. What is Terra Dying at? It's at $44. It started at 38. Maybe if it's on the way up, we could buy a bunch of those. I think we keep the fired men's funds until the end of the week, though, because it's already Thursday. Nice, 595. Look at that shit. That was a wise hold. I almost switched, but I was wise not to. Oh, it's back on top, baby. Never had a single doubt. Did I upgrade my fiance? Is that an option? I didn't realize. <laughs> Swimming. We should go to the gym after this, probably. We must buy a dog. I will take the poodle. Game is save. Yeah, write that down. Make sure to write the inverse color characters as well. Like, there's a C, 
There's a C, but there's also like an inverse C. Like, what is that? <laughs> Not to mention, it looks lowercase, and there's uppercase C's elsewhere. In here. Dude, it's a whole mess. There's no shot you're writing this bad boy down. There's absolutely no way. One could be a copyright symbol, maybe. Crier is top. We we're gonna we're going all in on Crier now. Maybe it really is that simple. Maybe you just keep buying the top one. If it really is that simple, then this is a very easy game. I guess we'll find out how effective that strat is. Sell stonks. Sell all of these. Who does this game feature? I think that's, uh, Ruth, the Ruthless, uh, what was it? Ruth, the Ruthless Banker, and Stanley, the Crafty Consultant, according to the box art. Also, our fiancé on the left, presumably, who we are the hero of in some unseen way. <laughs> it's not clear. Yeah, what's in the briefcase? We'll never know. I still have 52,000 left over. I could buy another one. I could probably buy one more that's really cheap. What's on the leaderboard? Strayhound, Terra Dying, Pan Mam. I will buy one stock in Pan Mam. Unless they cost 26, in which case I could buy two. They cost 30, I can only afford one. Fair play. Go to the gym. You didn't get anything confiscated today? Congrats! Can't believe my luck. <laughs> Strayhound, YBM, Xerox, Boeing, AT&T. Everything that we invested in is no longer on the leaderboard. But we still profited from them? So maybe we just pivot to Strayhound? Maybe. What's Strayhound at right now? 81? Here I go. I will be hearing this song in my sleep. I will be. For the rest of time, I will be hearing this tune. Death Waiting Room music. <laughs> 680? Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty substantial. Could have muted it any time. Put on something else. I could also turn it up if you'd like. I mean, if you really want me to, I could crank that shit. And then nobody has a good time. But I will refrain, because I'm not that evil. I love it. Yo, Scolionage! Chat, I will turn this car around so hard. <laughs> I will turn this car around! Yeah, base boost it. I wonder if this emulator has extremely dank. Too bad, you should have paid closer attention to the morning paper. Ah, shit, I wasn't supposed to go swimming. Now we got fucking chlorine poisoning. 
720. We're making money a lot faster than we ever have. Crier, Strayhound, yep, yep, yep. Space Expedition set for early next year. Alright, let's go to the gym. No, let's go hiking. That takes the entire day. That's fine. 736. You'd go for a hike or two? Tell me about it. After Friday, we need to switch, because it's going to shift Gymnasium under investigation. <laughs> Rich Air is found dead in a pool. Password. Right. Save the password. Okay, now that it's Monday, what's the new, what's the new hotness? Boing? Are we really? Are we, are we boing? Are we going all in on boing? <laughs> Alright, I'll do it. I see no downsides to this plan. It's a flawless gambit. God damn, those are expensive, though. Still have six thousand left over, but that's not that's not enough to do anything with. Go picnic. Go picnic. Go swim. We've recorded absolutely zero profits for this. That seems about right, yeah. Rattel Toys. Back on top. Tick Abundance attacks family on hiking grounds. What is Rattel Toys at right now? They're at 35. If we buy a shit ton of Rattel Toys while they're at 35, and they're on the up and up, We'd get massive profits out of that. Let's backdash out of this, because this didn't move at all. And there's only five stocks anyway. I'm pivoting back to Retail Toys. Here I go. 21? Yeah, <laughs> Yapple. <laughs> it's funny, I don't think Yapple has ever, like, shown up on the list. <laughs> Nothing ever happens with Yapple in this game. I think it went up one dollar. It ain't that much. Retail Toys still on top, though. If it gets like a two or a three dollar bump, that would be enormous. Let's go to the carnival. That takes the entire day. 798, that's pretty significant. Carnivore Cruise Lines, YBM, Xerox, Kaufman and Broad. Let's go hiking. What in-game year? I assume 1990, the same year the game came out. Yeah, the newspaper says today, 1990. So we're at 840 with a week to go. It wouldn't be unheard of to make enough uh, money. Yeah, it just says today. It wouldn't be unheard of to try and 
get 160 in that time. I think it's very possible. Uh, shopping. Swimming. Yeah, almost a millionaire. We're gonna have to sell after this little trip to the dealership. I'm not buying a car. We don't got that kind of money. Oh, I should save here. Eight sixty-one, and we have until the twenty-eighth, so we've got five days, really. Fireman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks. I'd be willing to bet that the start of this game is the hardest part, just because you are you're on such a deadline. <laughs> you're on such a tight, like, deadline. American Depress was on here. Firedman's Fund. I think Rebucks was in there, too. Let's check that newspaper again. Fireman Fun, American Depress, Rebucks, Boeing, Carnivore, Cruise Lines. Let's see what they are at right now. American Depress is at 81. It started at 64. Carnivore is on its way up. It's up 10 bucks from where it started. Okay. Fireman's Fund, I think, started at like $69, right? 66? Let's go for... Let's go for American Depress here, because it started at about the same money. It started at about the same as the Fireman's Fund, and this one got as high as 92. So maybe American Depress is on its way up to about that much. That'd be huge. We could be wildly off base here. I can only afford 10 of these. I still have money. I still have money. I can buy something else. Give me one Rebucks. Just the one. All right. <laughs> I would so I would so love to just go all in on Yapple and see what happens. <laughs> well, they never mentioned Yapple at all. Just nothing happens. 900! That was very good. That was big, huge profit. American Depress, Fireman's Fund, YBM, Xerox, Rebucks. I think we just keep holding what we're doing. We just, we just keep holding on and see if we can get there in time. Go to the carnival. Gonna get Y2K. 971. We are almost there. We need a million total. So we're at what? 989 total. We're so close. This is it. Yeah, we just keep holding, really, because everything that we put money in is it's still. It's still exploding. Yeah, big stonks. Let's go hiking. Big, huge money. We're so back. Ah! Oh, we're, we're so back! Oh, big. We probably have to sell, though. Like, because we were told to bring it in cash. 
So we have to, like, sell before the day. Uh... We can sell on Friday. I don't think we have to sell yet. Yeah. We do... We just do whatever today. Kill some time. Shift to Friday. Then we sell on Friday. One million sixty-four thousand dollars. Yeah, imagine if it went down and it took us back below. <laughs> That'd be so shitty, dude. So we have to sell today. Reg! Here are some stocks to buy on the day of today. 2024, Chat Valkyrie Online Storefronts, Pi mm -hmm. Search Engines and Software and Nanosoft and its hit video game mm -hmm. Console the Sea Box. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if any of that is accurate. I would, uh, I would not take this stream, or myself, or anyone in the chat room. I would not use any of it as valid financial <laughs> advice. Disclaimer, I'm not an expert. <laughs> buy Rebucks? We don't want to buy anything because we need a million dollars in cash to buy the fucking house. Here we go. Finally, some progress. Good morning. This is Ralph. Just calling to make sure you're awake. I'll meet you at the house. Oh, let's go! I'm glad you decided to buy this gorgeous house. Well, it's all yours. Thank you. Enjoy. I'm fucking bankrupt, dude. Let's go! Congratulations! You've accomplished the first step. Your new house is a decent beginning for a Benedict. Thank you for the wedding invitation. I'll be there. The Benedict tradition is to honeymoon on a yacht. A decent yacht may cost around 700000 you can always take a loan from the bank. I'll have the boat salesman call you. Just a reminder, please keep saving your money for the castle, too. Jesus Christ. I gotta take a loan. I gotta buy a fucking yacht. I gotta buy a castle. Fuck, dude. Alright, I'm saving my game right here. How am I so rich and yet so bankrupt at the same time? No, we couldn't have taken a loan for the house. We tried several times. <laughs> yeah, how am I so rich and so poor simultaneously? Okay, we've made progress. Give me like, give me like four minutes. Give me like three, four minutes. I just need to recharge my brain. I'll be right back.
right, I'm back. <laughs> the brain is adequately refreshed and restored and replenished, but we now must go back into the hellacious battlefield that is Wall Street. I should save my game right here. Uh, save that. Yeah, back to the mines, dude. The cutthroat blood sport that is Wall Street. The Wall Street Times. Okay. Blue chip and cyclical stocks are surpassing others. We could get some Boeing, Carnivore Cruise Lines. I think Carnivore is usually pretty cheap, so we could probably get a bunch of them. Local hero to be given ticker tape welcome after saving drowning guinea pig. Who's calling that phone? Doc. <laughs> Hello, this is Doc. Larry asked me to call you. He told me you were interested in buying a yacht. I'll be getting a hold of one next week. I'll call you back then with all the details. Who was phone? Okay, step one, we need a loan. Please, I need a loan. Your collateral can be applied against a loan for up to 800,000 plus 5% interest, which comes to 840k. The balance is due on the 31st. Okay. How much is the yacht? 700,000? That's not that bad. Right? They said the yacht was 700,000. The loan by itself gives us enough. We just need to continue to make money. Should we double our money first? How? <laughs> yeah, we gotta go back into stonks either way. Our loan balance is due on Wednesday the 31st. So... We, yeah, we're gonna need, like, 1.5 mil, because we have to buy the boat, and then we have to pay back 840 grand. How hard could that be? Check the paper again? What was up? Blue chip cyclical. Let's get some carnivore cruise lines. Obviously, if we're buying a yacht, we gotta get the cruise line stock. Obviously, this is how it works. The logic is sound. I see no way this plan backfires. Dude, the yacht costs so much. I have enough money to get, like, one more stock. Give me, like, a Kaufman. Give me, like, a Kaufman. Just one. Or do I? Do I want a Kaufman? Yeah, just give me one. And then we go picnicking. And then we go to the gym. No, we don't have time to go to the gym. We gotta go swimming. Why did a yacht cost as much as the house? Have you seen the yacht? Have you seen- I mean, how much are real-life yachts? Aren't they like several million dollars? Aren't they like a shit ton? <laughs> Okay, we got some profit. Yeah, hopefully the yacht can be collateral. We're probably gonna have to take another loan. Kaufman and Broad, let's go! Okay. Let's do... Let's go to the carnival. Because we just need to pass days. 972, that's a big one. That ain't bad at all. Are we still all in on one top hot stock? Yeah. So I think the strat is look at the top stocks, but don't grab the most expensive one. Grab the least expensive one. That way... You have, like, the most multiplier when things change. That feels like the- that feels correct. I- that might not be how we're meant to do it, but it's kind of working. 
We can always back up to uh, May 1st. I dropped a save there. Yeah, bold strat. Carnivore is up $5. Kaufman is up $2. I only have one stock in Kaufman. But we were just kind of hoping that Carnivore Cruise Lines blows the fuck up. That's what we're hoping. Okay. Okay, we're back up to a mill. Not bad. Centipede is the top stock at the moment. There have been reports of dangerously defective chemicals being sold to pool owners. We're not going swimming today. We're going shopping. And then we're going to the gym. Sorry, we're closed. Never mind. We're not going to the gym. I thought about it. I changed my mind. I don't want to work out today. Rattel Toys. Rattel Electronics presents... Tick Abundance attacks family on hiking grounds. We're not going... Hiking today. Hi, honey. We should look at some TV and stereo sets for our new house. TVs ain't that expensive. We could probably buy one. That sounds like a good idea. We'll go for a look tomorrow. Alright, see you tomorrow. Let me sell my Kaufman stock. Let me sell my one Kaufman stock. Because I don't know how expensive this fucking TV is about to be. I got $40,000. There's no fucking way that there's a TV that costs more than what I am holding. There's no way. Do we need to buy it? Probably not. Audio and video. Hey, dude! Want something? We're looking for a TV and stereo set for our new home. We got a Pana Zodiac system for 3000 and a shower system for 1500 Which one do you want, dude? These TVs are pretty, uh, expensive. I don't know about this one, boys. It's amazing how we can invest in a company that involves exterminating spiders, fleas, and scorpions from a client's mushroom garden, DNO. Certainly better than investing into steamrollers, bulldozers, and cranes. I don't know, investing in... Monks are con smug. Investing in, uh, construction seems pretty smart most of the time. I'm gonna get the Pana Zodiac. It's only 3k. That's not too bad. Oh, save game. Save right here. Eh, save. Eh, there we go. Blue chip speculative stocks swim above the drowners. Cryer is the hottest stock. Strayhound, Terra Dying, Pan Mam Airlines. Bethlehem Steel. Do the interest rates matter now? No, I think they told us all the interest. They said we'd have to pay back 840. I don't think that they add more interest. I think that that's like the total interest we'll have to pay at the end. This particular yacht's a classic and selling for $700,000. The owner is on the urge of bankruptcy and can only accept cash for it. If you agree to buy now and end up not having enough money on Saturday, you'll lose the deal. I can't afford to hold a classic for empty promises, especially if another buyer comes along. Am I interested? Not just yet. Because the more money I have, the more money I can make. Well, if the yacht isn't already sold, I'll call you next week to see if you're ready. So, we need to call him 
or we need to accept that on like the 20th or something, right? We have to pay the loan back on the 31st, which means somewhere up in the 20s we have to buy that boat. Let's see. I did not pay attention to what was up. Blue chip speculative stocks swim above the drowners. Cry or stray hound terror dying. I'm tempted to go Pan Mam Airlines here. Pan Mam is like the cheapest one, which means we can buy the most of them. And if they go up in value, it's big, huge number go up. I'm tempted. How much is it? It's $31 right now. I can buy 33 of these bitches! If it even profits one dollar, that'd be great. Yeah, we bought the house, we're good. Now we have to buy a fucking yacht for our wedding. Because <laughs> we're getting wed. Yeah, Charles Schlob is that stuck. Do we need a yacht? We do. It's apparently a Benedict family tradition to get married on a yacht. There's just no other way. Alright, so it went up one dollar, Pan Mam did. Green herring! Buying an expensive vehicle for your wedding seems legit. I agree. YBM Xerox Boeing AT&T Crier? Mm-hmm, 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 So Pan Mam did go up one dollar. Fair enough. It seems like Pan Mam doesn't budge a whole lot. It seems like it doesn't budge too much, most of the time. Like, it has a pretty low range of motion overall, seemingly. Willing to wait another day. It went up another dollar, I think. Alright, let's pivot to... let's pivot to Cryer here. Buy stocks. Cryer is at what right now? Eighty-two dollars! My money! Oh no! That's alright. We still have 45k! Give me... Rebucks is on a downward spiral right now. If I buy a Rebucks, it'll pay off later. In theory. <laughs> He says, with no confidence that that is how it works. Right, that was about the same size to profit. Blue chip speculative stonks swim above the drowners. Cryer is still up there. Pan Mam Airlines. Right. Let's just go hiking today. I have no desire to change anything. Just roll with it. We're increasing steadily, I just don't know if it's fast enough. It just always goes up. Hey, Dino, does this game has Rebucks rival Athena? No. 
I am patiently waiting for your significant other to divorce you and take half your stuff in the court proceedings. Can you imagine if this game had prenup mechanics? Can you imagine how ultimate this game would be? <laughs> thank you, TDX. Thank you, Ridge. Maybe we should buy a painting for the main entrance in our new home. What type of painting? I've found a wonderful art gallery. Why don't you come with me tomorrow and help me pick one out? You got it. Let's go to the gym. Let's go to the gym to prepare for this trip to the art gallery. Let me sell my... I lost two dollars on this Rebuck stock, but I might need a lot of money to buy a fucking painting. May I help you? It's Art, who works at an art gallery. Good. We're interested in purchasing a painting. Well, we have an Ali for 50,000, a Nua for 30,000. Aha! Aha! Bit rich for my blood. No, thank you. Yeah, Art Vandalay. Ha! Huh? Who's calling that phone? Who? I didn't authorize this. It's alright, there's nobody important. Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Hot stocks bulletin. Fireman's funds. Cryer is still up there. Three bucks. Gymnasium, no going to the gym today. The yacht doesn't have a buyer yet. Larry told me that you must buy a, a yacht before your honeymoon. There's just no other way. If you're ready, I can meet you on Saturday. Don't forget, if you don't have the cash on Saturday, the deal is off. No, I am not prepared yet. Sabotaging our ability to haggle. We're already holding crier stocks, which are still, like, on their way up. Like, according to the newspaper, they're still, like, the hot... They're still the hot shit right now. Yeah, we need, like, a hundred... We need 1.54 million? Yeah. Which is a lot. Next day. Cryer is on the way up. Adam Admar. Hello, it's me, Scam. I got a good bridge in Brooklyn to seal you for one billion dollars. <laughs> However, I need it now, and if you don't have it by so day, then we will sink the Golden Gate Bridge. Think about it. I don't want either bridge. What am I gonna do with a bridge? <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bridges. I can't do anything with those. <laughs> Terra Dying is on the top of the leaderboard. They sell for 57? What did they start at? They started at 38, so they're swinging wildly upwards. I wonder if they keep going. Let's try and pivot to Terra Dying just because we can hold more of them. It seems like this game kind of steers you towards buying the cheaper ones just because you can hold a higher quantity of them. Which I guess makes sense. And I guess we'll go shopping. And we'll go swimming. Nothing happens to Merit Not. We've seen it once ever. Some of the stocks we've never seen on the leaderboard at any point. I've never seen... I've never seen Yapple on there. Charles Schlob showed up, like, once or twice. Kaufman's not very popular. Centipede, not that popular on there. Yapple, I don't think I've ever seen on that leaderboard. Not even once. I could be wrong. We are profiting pretty quickly, though. 
This is kind of working out. I don't know if we get enough quickly enough. Maybe. Charles Schlob? No carnival today. The deadline is May 31st for the loan, yeah. But the deadline is also, like, next week for the boat. We do have enough for the boat, but not the loan. I know a good buddy, Vern, who has a neighbor who went to the barber shop to get the style of a Wall Street tycoon, but the barber instead gave him the style of Daniel Boone, complete with <laughs> raccoon skin hat. Thank you, Ridge. Charles Schlob, they just said, was on the way up, right? It's only $5 higher than what it started at, so it could be due for, like, a big swing. Maybe. Or maybe we just hold what we have very tightly to our chest. Maybe we hold these. They already went up two bucks. They could go up more bucks. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe. Shopping. Thank you, Reg, for the 100 bits. The good news is we already have enough for the boat. It's just the boat and the loan. We don't have the combined amount we need. Oh, hello! That was a huge one! We made like 100k there! Oh, that was huge. We were wise to hold... Terra Dying's back oh, on top, yeah. baby! We're so back! Gymnasium under investigation by the health department. We went shopping yesterday, so let's go hiking today. One, four, five, two. Okay. Probably next week. We probably have to, uh... We have to try and buy the boat next week. No doubt. And then we have to hope that we can make the last bit that we need for the loan. Fireman's fun, Terra Dying. I think we keep holding on to the Terra Dying until the end of the week. Let's go shopping. Four hour activity. Nice password. Absolutely absurd password. I will save that here. Alright, how we doing? I think we went down a tiny amount there. Which means it's definitely time to sell. But that's okay because it's Monday, the sh it just like shifted. Yeah, that makes sense. Rising stocks outpaced by blue chip and growth stocks. Fireman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks, Boeing, Carnivore, Cruise Lines. Okay. Frog race was redeemed. Let's try and buy this boat first. Hi, this is Doc. I don't have a buyer for the yacht yet. I think you should strongly consider buying this time, or your time will be up. If you're ready, I can meet you at the harbor on Saturday and we can finish the deal. Yeah, we have to. So that means we have until... Saturday? We've got until... Yeah, we pretty much next week we have to... Okay, let's sell what we're holding. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, we're kind of getting somewhere. Let me check the paper again. Fireman's Fund, American Depress, Rebucks, Boeing, Carnivore Cruise Lines. Of those, the cheapest ones are Rebucks and Carnivore Cruise Lines. So let's see which one is... Let's see how they are doing. There is a lawn mower outside my home. And ironically, it is more pleasant to hear than this music loop. Carnivore Cruise Lines is at $58 right now. It started at 34 Carnivore Cruise Lines is exploding in value. Let's see Rebucks. Rebucks is a lot cheaper right now. Rebucks is currently $8 up. Huh. It is on the way to being number one. 
I think that maybe we go rebucks here. Carnivore is already up a shit ton, and I feel like it's gonna slow down. Whereas I feel like rebucks has a lot more room to grow. Just because it's only up $8 right now. I could be wrong. I don't do stonks. Could be wildly incorrect, but that's what my gut is telling me. How many of those can I afford? 31 Reebok stonks! Cool. Uh, picnic? Yeah, put the lip- if, if we could have invested in Sofell, it would have just been the smartest thing to do. They would have made it so that it was always good. <laughs> Let's go, okay. We're almost at our magic number. We're looking at- we need one million five hundred forty thousand dollars to buy both. Rebucks is still on there. Another gangster shoot up at a downtown tavern after big brawl. No injuries reported. <laughs> Stonks more like stinks. So true. We will do the poem and we'll do the frog race after we purchase this boat. So we have to cash out by Friday, because we have to have the money in cash on Saturday. We have to cash out by by Friday. Let's go! We almost have enough! Rebucks. Hey, Yapple computer! Let's go, Yapple! <laughs> we finally got one! Dude, Sleeve Dobbs, he's up. <laughs> Hello, this is Ruth. Please do not forget that your due date for the loan is a week from today. That's fine. That's fine. You won't have to break my knees, it's fine. <laughs> She's sharpening the knife as we speak. Oh, yes, we have enough money. Yes, we made it. Somehow, some way. Market data, rising stocks outpaced by blue chip and growth stocks. Yapple Computer is number one. You're telling me that computers are going to take off? That's... What kind of crazy, whacked out future are you living in? Computers? It's a fad. Get out of here. Get real. No way. What a preposterous hypothesis. Okay, so we have to cash out tomorrow. We'll hold for one more day. We have to cash out now. Because we have to have the money for both. Hello, this is Doc. I just wanted to remind you not to forget the $700,000 cash. I'll see you tomorrow. You got it. Sir, yes sir. Sell my stocks. I got the money I need. We're good. I got enough money to pay for everything. Good morning. This is Doc. Just calling to make sure you're awake. I'll meet you at the harbor. Oh, look at this boat! I know you're gonna love this yacht. Thank you. Have a wonderful honeymoon. 
We did it. <laughs> I see you've bought a beautiful yacht. What an accomplishment. You did it. You're a plutocrat. Oh, thank I'm you. I'm so proud of you. I knew I could do it, Skoliodage. Thank you. I've just found out that the castle will be for sale at an auction. I'll keep you informed of anything else I learn about it. Okay, we've hit a crucial checkpoint. We will use this point to come back to in the future if we fuck up. We will return to this point right here. Memorial Day? Oh, it just skipped Memorial Day. Yeah, we just skipped it. Market's closed. Yep. Interest rates are dropping while prices remain stable. Blue chip and cyclical stocks surpass others. Good. Carnivore cruise lines, Rattel toys. I think we're going all in on carnivore here. Wait, I have to pay the loan by the 31st. I have to, like, buy these and then immediately cash them out the next day. <laughs> or can I even? I don't even know if I can. Am I supposed to just hold? <laughs> I don't even know. All right, hold that thought. Hold that thought. A frog race was redeemed. A poem was redeemed. Let's do those and then we'll get back to stonks. Place your bets. I'm having fun today. This is a fun stream. I'm not sure why. It's just ferocious menuing, but I'm enjoying it. I do enjoy number go up. Number go up feels very good. I'm happy to hear it, Tepid Snake. Don't you worry. I have more streams about bad financial decisions in the works. Don't worry. There's more where this came from. All right, betting time is over. 29 of you think Mr. X will win. 28% of you think a Flareon described, uh, disguised as a frog will win. Frog Shaman Joshua. I didn't even notice that frog. Best of luck, everyone. Who's got the lead frog? Number one has the early lead. He peels out. Can anyone keep up? No, not a chance. 808 with a convincing victory. They almost finish in sequential order. Pay it out to Lord 808. A decisive victory for frog number one. 337,000 new yen given to 22 lucky winners. Congratulations to all 22 of you. My heartfelt condolences to everybody that did not win the frog race. No. My frog stocks are in shambles. <laughs> Steve Frogs will have to answer for this. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mayo Cats. Mayo Cats also redeemed the poem some 10 minutes ago. Let's, uh, play that one. Hey, Stampede. How about a poem? Glass, flat, and forever. It stretches out and never stops. Unless it finds the hills whose lines rise to mountain peaks far as far can be. Mm, thank you, Mayo Cats, for the 200 bits and the poem. Okay. Am I even allowed to buy stocks today? File for frog race bankruptcy. <laughs> frog race bankruptcy. I don't think I'm allowed to buy stocks today. Because the deadline to pay the loan is tomorrow, and they might, like, not let me... Justifies a save st well, I mean, we have the save back from when we bought the boat. Tell you what. We'll try it, and then if we accidentally fucked this up, we'll just retreat back to that password. 
Carnivore cruise lines. Let's buy a bunch of those. <laughs> I've got the money, I swear! Please don't break my legs. You know I'm good for it. <laughs> Let's see if it lets me cash out before I have to pay the loan back. Brad! I didn't meet the deadline to buy the house cause I put everything on the frog race. Yeah. I'll never make it as a Benedict now. At least I didn't have to buy the dog. I know what you mean. I know exactly what you mean. Okay, we made a little money. Wall Street Times, we have to pay back the loan today. We got a little bit of money first. Hello, miss? Hello, this is Ruth. Sir, today is your due date for the loan. Please do not forget to pay off the balance. Or I'll have my people get in touch with your people. Anyway, let's pay that off. Hello, it's nice to see you again! Which service can I provide you with? Uh, I'll just, just, just I'll, I'll, I'll pay it off, I swear. Would I like to pay off your loan? Yes, please. Thank you for your payment. Please feel free to contact us for any future services we can help you with. Aren't I just gonna have to take more loans out? Like, immediately? <laughs> Don't I just take that same loan? <laughs> right? <laughs> I think we literally just do the loan again. Hello, it's nice to see you again. Give me a loan. Your collateral can be applied against a loan to up to 800000 The balance would be due on the 30th. That's okay. Yeah, I'll just renew the damn loan. Can I take another loan? For, like, my yacht? Is that possible? No, I'm only allowed to have one loan at a time. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Noted, understood. Yeah, repeat forever. Uh, let me- I gotta check the paper again. I don't know who's up. I think it's still Carnivore Cruise Lines, right? Yeah. Or Rattel? We can do some Rattel toys? So we gotta pay that off by the 30th. Carnivore Cruise Lines is at 72. They started at 34 dollars. They are up so much. Carnivore Cruise Lines, all for meat. Meat for all. Oh, meat for all. I think we go Retail Toys here. They're also up hugely, but they have more room to grow, whereas I feel like Carnivore Cruise Lines is going to come crashing down at some point. I think we go... I think we go Rattel here. I say this with no information whatsoever, but... That feels... it feels right. I got two hours left, I'm going swimming. Yeah, 111% upswing? That's absurd. Hey, we got 60k. That was a good one. That was a good day. Carnivore Cruise Lines, Retail Toys. Yep. Today we should go shopping. Yeah, we already paid off the loan interest. Skip to next day. Made another, like, 45,000 there. Is there anything that we have to save money for right now? I guess it's just that castle. They said that there was, like, a auction for the castle happening at the end of the month? 
Something like that? Who's calling that phone? Hey, thanks for tuning in, Tepid Snake. Hi, it's Priscilla. Tomorrow's the big day. I'm so happy. Our honeymoon on the yacht will be so exciting. Shit, am I gonna be able to... I can't do stonks if I'm on honeymoon. I can't do stonks on honeymoon. Shit, dude. Okay, so we gotta make a... We got an important decision to make right now. Carnivore Cruise Lines just keeps going. I think we buy Carnivore Cruise Lines, and then when we get back from Honeymoon, we're filthy stinking rich. That's what I think. Here's a fun fact for chat. If you go to your city's financial district, mm -hmm. find the bar that opens at like noon. If you see someone in a suit drinking on a weekday, they just lost a ton of money. <laughs> Yeah, that's probably true. You know what? I got faith in Rattel Toys. I got faith in- I got faith in Rattel Toys. I'm gonna hold- I'm gonna hold on to that shit. What do I- I got 15 stocks of Rattel Toys. Nah, we're good. They're gonna shoot to the moon while we're off on honeymoon. I'm so- I'm so certain of this. I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna do it. Getting married! We did it. We got married. Oh. Congratulations on your marriage. Your beautiful new wife will fit into the Benedict family very nicely. I've just been informed that the castle will be sold at an auction on July 1st. And 10% of the closing bid will be due in cash. The balance must be paid by July 28th. Okay. Hold on. I need to write some days down. I literally, I need to open a notepad document. Let me see. Okay. Uh, what is it right now? It's June, isn't it? June 30th. Loan. Uh, July 1st. Auction. July 28th. July 28th. Castle. Eh, okay. <laughs> They need to, like, literally write this shit down. I got I got so much shit I gotta keep track of. <laughs> Please keep in mind that maintaining the Benedict fa uh, standard of living doesn't only include showing money, profit, and manageability. Your health and marriage conditions are also subject to judge. First of all, who the fuck are you to judge me? Second of all... That's all I got, actually. It's fine. You know what? <laughs> it's fine. Alright, I will drop a save here. Oh! Happy Honeymooners! Yes. Look at the days go. We're getting... We are profiting. We are getting some money out of this, yeah. Mattel climbed somewhat. Okay, okay, profit, nice. Cool, okay. Stocks at the mercy of time, yeah. So now we just need... Now we're just kind of playing the stonks game until... Now we're playing the stonks game until the day before the auction, which is the 30th. But the 30th is also the day we have to pay the loan back slash get a new loan. <laughs> I suppose the question is, how much is that castle going to be if it's at an auction? The auction for the castle is only three weeks away. You must get that castle back to keep the family heritage from being destroyed. 
I've confirmed that the starting bid will be two million dollars. Just to be on the safe side, I suggest you bring at least one million dollars cash to the auction. Do your best to save, but be careful not to neglect your wife! Well, they said that I only needed 10% of it, right? They said that 10% of it was due as a down payment, so... I'm probably only gonna need, like, three, four hundred thousand for the down payment. Dude, we're gonna need to make a lot of money. Yeah, 10% of the closing bid. That's gonna be pretty rough. Okay. To the newspaper. What the hell is up right now? What is up? We need to see what is up. Freedman or Fireman's Fun, Crier, Rebucks, Terra Dying, Stray Hound. Let's get something that is cheap. Yeah, two mil starting. Not if I always... Not if I... Well, hopefully... I, we don't know how fucked the auction is. It could be extremely fucked, I'm not sure. This is an NES game. It could be. It could be brutal. Rebucks, Stray Hound, Terra Dying. Rebucks is the cheapest of the ones that are... Like, up right now. At least I think Rebucks was on there. Let's check the paper again. <laughs> We're gonna need, like, 8 mil. There's no way. We've been barely scraping by. I'm going in. Going in on Rebucks. 18 shares of Rebucks. Picnic. What parent buys their kid a game on the stock market? You've made a crucial assumption, and that's that the NES is for the kids, and not for themselves. Alright, we got some money. Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Bethlehem, Steel, Fireman's Fund, Cryer, American Depress. Rebox is gone from the list. We might pivot to one of these now. We might pivot to Cryer. It's usually pretty cheap. Pivot. Pivot. Pivoting. Ultimo. Corn futures are showing midday weakness on Monday, as the board is down 3 to 4 cents across most front months. <laughs> I lied. Cryer is not cheap. Cryer is expensive as hell. We're going Bethlehem. We saw that on the leaderboard. Ultimo, thank you for the 100 bits. I can afford 18 shares of Bethlehem steel. I have 55,000 left. Uh, that's probably enough to get something. Ace Balthazar! Hey, for the six whole years, I will buy one share of Charles Schlob. You think for the six whole years of Prime Gaming Ace? Okay. Not a bad profit. Fireman's Fun. Bethlehem Steel is still on there, yeah. Rebucks is back. We're gonna hold the Bethlehem. We're holding the Bethlehem shares. Let's just go Carnival. That sounds good! Let's have a fun day at Carnival. Oh, wow, we almost got 100k there. That was... that was a very good day. Bethlehem Steel, number one. Let's fucking go. We need to keep holding the Bethlehem's share. Equipment failures cause injuries at the carnival. Thank God we got out of there in time. <laughs> we dodged a bullet, boys! I'm going hiking. Another 55,000.
Yeah, the loan payback date is June 30th, which is also the day before the auction. So we need to pay the loan that day and then get a new loan so that we have money for the auction. <laughs> it's a whole mess. We're gonna need a lot of money, certainly. We need to pray. We have to pray that, like, the final price of the castle is not prohibitively expensive. I'm selling my Bethlehem Steel shares. I'm selling my Charles Schlob share. It's anything more than 10 mil. We're super cooked, I agree. We only need 10% for the down payment. Or, you know, whatever it is. I There's no doubt in my mind we can afford that. We, sh we can easily afford that. We just need to hope that the final cost of the castle is not, like, the worst thing ever. Who's up? Fired Men's Fund, Terra Dying, Cryer, Pan Mam, Stray Hound. If Pan Mam is still, like, extremely cheap... What is it at right now? Pan Mam is at 41. It is on an uptick. Let's try this. It's Friday, so we're only gonna get, like, one day out of this. Huh? Let's have a housewarming party. Let's see how much it'll cost first. Well, we can have a nice party for 20,000, a very simple party for 10,000. Which would I prefer? I guess the, the lesser one. Thank you, dear. It'll be fun! When's the party? Did we just have the party? I didn't even have 10k. It must have taken it out of my stonks. <laughs> I hate this party already. Cryer, Stray Hound, Pan Mam is still going up. Yeah, house warming, not... <laughs> we just warm up the house. How's Pan Mam doing? Pan Mam went up a dollar, but it's still on the leaderboard and it's still on like an uptick, right? Pan Mam is a speculative stock. Are speculative stocks up right now? Blue chip and speculative stocks swim above the drowners, yeah. So Pan Mam stands to gain more here. I just don't know if it's like enough. Cryer is now at 131. It started at 48, so it's huge. <laughs> huge gain over how we started. Yeah, I'm gonna keep holding. I'm gonna keep holding the pan, man. Next day. Okay, went up another dollar. It's gains, but it's slow gains. And I don't know if that's enough. We need, like, huge gains. Yapple computer, we're so back! I'm tempted to buy some Yapple right now. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna buy some Yapple shares. Here I go. How much is Yapple right now? 121. I can only I can only buy 11 of these. Yapple has to pop off. They have to. They're going to pop off right now. I can feel it. Let me give me that one Pan Mam share back. It's got to pay off, right? It's got to Next day. We made about 60,000, that's not bad. It's not bad at all. Yapple's still back on top, let's go, dude! Yapple's gonna carry us! 
The apple's gonna carry us into the future. I'm going hiking. Celebratory Yapple hike. This takes eight hours. This takes the whole day. Next day, we're up another $56,000. Yapple is still on top. 83-year-old woman comes in first in the annual USA Marathon, now wanted for Channel 3 Sports Show. Let's see here. If Yapple was, like, number one on the list, that means that it had the biggest profits of all the stocks that day. Which means we couldn't really have done any better unless there was a really cheap one that we could have had a million of. They're <laughs> working on a little thing called an iBod, yeah. Let's go to the gym. We'll go to the gym, we'll go to a picnic. So that the wife doesn't divorce me. It's a very strenuous relationship. If you neglect her for two frames, she already wants a divorce. Crier. Yapple is off the list entirely. It might be time to pivot, but it's already Friday. Tick Abundance attacks family on hiking grounds. Hi, honey! I found a wonderful dress designer to design a dress that I can wear to our party! Please come and help me pick a design tomorrow. You got it. You got it. Okay, let's go. DZ Kujaku! They were the 50 old years! We gotta pick out a dress, dude. I'm cooked. Hello, this is Ruth. Please don't forget that your due date for the loan is a week from today. Don't think I forgot. Um... I think we sell today. We sell the Yapple, we sell the Pan Ma'am. Let me see what's up. A <laughs> Yapple personal computer. Ah, yes, the Yakintosh. I know it well. Cryer, YBM, ZROX, Terradying. Let's get some Cryer shares. Hot damn, those are expensive now. <laughs> the Yoragon Trail. Uh, picnic. Swimming. Next day. Ah, yes. May I help you? I'd like to have you design a party dress for me. Well, I can design A, a dress with just a bit of jewelry for 20k, or a simple dress for 10k. Which design would you like? Lamau, the cheaper one. Do you have cubic zirconiums? It's so lovely. Let's save. I'm sorry, you said it's how much? It's how much for five carrots? No, no, no. We can fool her with a fake one. She, she can't tell the difference, it's fine. She's got real bad eyesight. As long as it's shiny. <laughs> like a fucking magpie. <laughs> Speculative and growth stocks climb while others crash. Fireman's funds. We do have crier shares already. We could hold the crier shares we're holding. How is... How much is Fireman's Fund? 270! Hot damn! 
I feel like we might have to pivot to a cheaper one just so we can benefit more from number go up. Because we only have 10 crier shares. But then, they're going up like multiple dollars at a time. So it might just be better to hold what we have. Might just be better to sit on it. As much as I am loath to admit it. Yeah, 225%. That is insane. I think that's total, like, from the start of the game, yeah. That's how much it's gone up. Hey, we got 90k there, that's good. Criers on top. We were wise to hold. They had the biggest profit. More giant cockroaches invade small South Seas Island. Giant cans of Rado used without success. Let's go to the carnival. What'd we get? We got another 90k. That's very good. If we're getting 90k in profits every day, that ain't bad at all. Cryer is still number one. We have to pay off the loan on the 30th, and it's the day before the auction, so we have to... We have to pay the loan, and then we have to take another loan. Actually, we probably don't have to take out another loan yet. We probably don't have to. Because we'd have enough money just to do the down payment. We take out the loan after the auction. And then that can probably carry us all the way to the down payment of the fucking castle, right? The loan is 840000 I think we pay the loan, but then we don't bother getting a new one until we're back from the auction. Go hiking. One hundred thirty thousand dollars in profit there. Holy shit, these crier shares are going insane. <laughs> we gotta play with the house's money, yeah. Oh, baby. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to keep holding until tomorrow. I'm going to continue to hold. The crying tears of gold. This was the wisest purchase we've made in a while. Okay, the 30th is the day we have to pay off the loan. It's the last day before the auction, so we need to make sure that we have cash on hand by the end of the day. So we have to cash out, we have to get the loan paid, and then we just kind of hold the rest of the money. Good morning. The big auction will be held tomorrow. Remember, depending on the bid, you need at least one million. You raised $800,000 in capital gains, but were only able to carry 4000 back to your wagon. <laughs> Also, you have dysentery. Ah, shit. <laughs> Dude, Wall Street Trail is a... That's a slam dunk of an idea. It's just like Oregon Trail. Same time period, same danger, same situation, but every character is a current-day Wall Street guy. And they just can't survive at all. <laughs> Hello, this is Ruth. Sir, today is your due date for the loan. Please don't forget to pay off the balance. I will find you. Fine. Sell our shares. We have to sell the shares. We have to pay off the loan. Loan payment. Just take it. Take the money. So the down payment... Alright, now we're getting into mid-maxi bits. The down payment is gonna be somewhere from, like, 
200k to probably like 500k, right? <laughs> he said to have a mill just to be sure. Ah, shit, maybe we shouldn't buy anything. It's Friday anyway, so if we buy now, everything's gonna be changed by the week. Tom Nuke has a castle to sell you, but I do not know the bell to cash conversion rate. <laughs> That's true. No, let's get a new loan after we're back from the auction. Because we need the loan to carry us all the way to, like, the having to pay the castle. Like, the full price of it. So we'll hold off. Uh, yeah, let's just, next day, let's just bring all our money to the auction. Oh, look at this! The auction is now beginning. House rules state 10% down on all closing bids. Balances must be paid in full by July 28th. We'll begin with the castle. Opening bid is $2 million. Do I hear $2 million? Once, twice, ladies and gentlemen, please place your bid. Uh... I can only change... Okay, it looks like I can bid 10,000. That's the, that's the lowest I can do, is 10,000. I feel like I should only increment this in, like, as few... I have to... I have no reason to bet high. I should increment this, like, as slowly as possible. 10,000. I'm sorry, that bid is lower than the last bid. You must bid more than the previous bid. Oh, I see. So I gotta go... Let's see. Two mil... Two mil, uh, ten thousand. The comma is in the wrong place and it's throwing me off. Or at least there should be, like, another comma. Two million, ten thousand. I mean, he wants me to bet 2.5 mil, but, like... Or he wants me to bid 2.5 mil, but why would I do that? Nobody... He, he, no one said... No one said two and a half mil. Which means I should just do this. The current bid is two million ten thousand dollars. Do I hear 2.5 mil? Going once? Going twice? Uh, no. No. I already have the bid. I'm gonna bid the same amount. I'm sorry, that bid's lower than the last bid. Am I bidding with myself right now? Is there a reason I can't just... <laughs> okay, I have to bid with myself, it seems. That's fine. You price gouging? I'm not going to two... I'm not going to 2.5 million. You can't make me video game. I won't do it. No, pressing start didn't work. I tried. We're not allowed to bet over... We're, we're not allowed to bid any farther than, like, these three digits. Current bid is $2,020,000. Am I allowed to wait it out? I don't think so. The castle's been sold for $2,020,000. Oh, we just got away with fucking murder, dude. We just got away with one. That is so payable. That's so payable. 10% deposit on the closing bids, $202,000. Thank you. Oh, baby. Congratulations, you've won the castle back. Now all you have to do is pay off the balance within four weeks. You're so close to carrying out the Benedict legacy and inheriting the fortune. Good luck! That wasn't much of an auction, I agree. Well, we need to drop another save here. I'd buy that for a dollar! All right, who's up? So we have until the 28th. Now, here's my question. If I take out a loan now, and the loan is due past the 28th, here, what I'm assuming is that the castle is the last thing I have to do, is just buy the castle. If the loan is due past that, do I just not have to pay it if the game ends when I buy the castle? <laughs> that, I guess that's my question. <laughs> What if the game ends and we just get away with it? <laughs> what if we wait closer to 728? We want to take the loan as early as possible because the more money we have, the more shares we can buy, which earns us more money. So we want to take the loan out right now. 
Who's on top? Boing is on top! Carnivore Cruise Lines, American Depress Rattel Toys, Fireman's Fund. I kind of want to go for Carnivore Cruise Lines because it had been building like crazy. We own the castle. That means we can take out a loan. Yeah, probably. Hello, this is Ruth at the bank. I'm just calling to remind you, you must pay off the balance on the castle by no later than Friday, July 8th. We'll have you squared and quartered if you don't pay it off. <laughs> Let's try and take a loan. Nice to see you again. Which service can I provide you with today? I need a loan, miss. Your collateral can be applied for up to 800000 Okay, so I'm only allowed to grab an $800,000 loan. The balance is due August 2nd. Here's my question. If we buy the castle on July 28th and the game ends, we don't have to pay this, right? Does the game keep going? <laughs> what, if <laughs> what if this works? <laughs> Save state? Nah, nah, nah. We saved at the password screen. The only place I'm willing to drop a save is on the password screen. That's about as close to legit as we could do it. I have to check the paper again. I don't know what stocks are up and which stocks are down. Boing, Carnivore Cruise Lines, American Depress, Rattel Toys, Firedman's Fund. Carnivore Cruise Lines has just been building and building and building all game. And I'm sure it's going to continue to do that, but the question is, is it worth how expensive the shares of it are by now? Or do we go for a cheaper one? Mm. Carnivore- oh, it's only at 92! It must have dipped again. It must have dipped at some point. Toys are in? We can get Rattel Toys shares for only 77. That ain't bad at all. I'm gonna get some- I'm- I'm back in. Back on- I'm back on Team Rattel Toys. Picnic. Swimming. How much did we profit? We made a bot. 70, 80. Independence Day! No work on Independence Day! I'm ruined! Wait, we got a bunch of money there. We got a bunch of money there. That's not bad. How long till Priscilla demands my credit card? We were wise to... We were wise to grab Rattel Toys. They are the number one stock right now. That was a wise purchase. We're so up. Toys are in, dude. The kids, they need Christmas presents. I don't know why people are shopping for them on July 5th, but... <laughs> Have over 2.8 million. I don't know if we can manage that by the 28th, but we'll see. It's Christmas in July, true! Next day. Holy shit, what a huge profit! We are so back! I could buy the rest of the castle right now! I got the money, I could buy the castle right now! Oh, dude, stonks! 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 Mmm, it feels good, dude! This game is going to awaken a financial problem in my life. Dump everything? Nah, dude, it's still building! Nah, we're gonna hold until the end of the week. Oh, another 150,000! Interest rates are dropping while prices remain stable. Blue chip cyclical stocks surpass others. Bruh, Rattel Toys was such a good buy. This was such a good purchase. Are you kidding me? 
Hollywood's talk show hosts make waves as they battle for overseas rating points. This was such a good buy. Toys are definitely in, 100%. We're going to the carnival. Next day. Your password! Uh, I'm running out of, like, save slots. I'm rotating my saves now. You know what? I'm gonna double save this one because we're so close to the end. I'm gonna double save it just to be extra sure. There we go. <laughs> Two point two, almost two point. I actually do have two point three mil, given the cash I'm holding. Rising stocks outpaced by blue chip and growth stocks. Firedman's fund is back. American depressed rebucks Boeing Carnival Cruise Lines. We need to ditch. We need to ditch the Rattel toys now, and we need to grab a new one. Which of these five do we feel will pop off most? One of these is gonna hit, really. One of these is gonna hit. We need to figure out which one. <laughs> Rebucks, because everybody wears shoes. We can get a Rebucks share for $84. That's not bad at all. Firedman's Fund is too expensive to really consider or is it or is it it's up 425 percent what if we buy like a small amount of these and it just fucking shoots as high into the sky as it possibly can i should invest in dank games that'd be like that'd be yapple certainly Yapple is a blue chip stock. Were blue chips up right now? I don't remember. How goes the stonks? We're actually really close to the end of this game, I think. We can almost buy the castle. Actually, we can already afford the castle. What we're really doing right now... Oh my god, YBM is going insane. YBM is up 300%. Started at 215, it's now 918. YBM is insane. That's a bit rich for my blood. I think we go... <sighs> mm. Let's check the paper again. Hold on. I am so into this video game right now. It's... It's insane how... <laughs> how much... How much fun I am having... <laughs> Rebucks, Boeing, Carnivore, Cruise Lines, American Depress. I obviously went into this stream at least somewhat like haha silly stonks meme stream. But now that we're this deep in, dude, no, this game... This game rules. <laughs> Carnivore is only 112. It's... they're pretty cheap right now and they're still on the up and up. We could get a bunch of shares of, uh, Carnivore. Or Rebucks. Mm. Rebucks is the cheapest one. Dr. Oop in awe. Money. Why invest in any other company when you can invest in Oop or Oop or to the moon? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the dollar do. Thank you for the 100 Oop Oz. I'm going with my gut. Carnivore Cruise Lines has never steered me wrong, and it's not about to start now. I have $69,000 in cash remaining. I just want to throw that fact out there. I should have paid closer attention to the paper! Oh no! Not the pool! Not chlorine poisoning! I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna survive to July 28th. I drank too much chlorine. Not like this. I only went up 20k. That was a very small profit there. Firedman's Fund, American Depress, YBM. Rebucks is on the way. We're pivoting to Rebucks right now. We're pivoting to shoes. Immediate pivot. 
Carnivore only went up one dollar. I need to gain fast. And cruise line too slow. We're pivoting to rebucks. Okay, go to the gym. Because we couldn't go swimming yesterday. I'm so into this. This is a fantastic NES game. I'm a huge fan. <laughs> That's what we're talking about. We got like 80k. Much more happy with that. YBM Fireman's Funds, American Depress. Rebucks is still up here. I think they're gonna go. I think Rebucks is gonna continue to climb. Muggers are becoming regular customers at the shopping mall. We're not going shopping today, but we will go to the carnival. Let's go, another 50k. Interest rates dropping while prices remain stable. YBM Fireman's Fund American Depress Rebucks has dropped to the number five slot. YBM is just taking off. Giant cockroaches invade small South Seas Island. What is YBM at now? If they just keep, if they're just popping off, eleven hundred. Weren't they nine hundred a second ago? We should have bought some of those. We should have bought some IB. We should have bought some YBM shares, dude. That's all right. That's all right. We'll get them next time. It's the one that got away. That's what we like to see. Big rebucks profit. They're gonna drop Yindos 3.1. Rising stocks outpaced by blue chip and growth. Mm. YBM is going insane. Rebox is back up to number four. Let's go. This is the hypest stonks game. Who's calling that phone? Hi, honey. Please come with me to the jewelers tomorrow to help pick out some jewelry to wear at our party. Cubic zirconium. How many carrots is a good amount? One carrot? I can get you like a one carrot. She's gonna tell me to buy something that's like... A hundred thousand, isn't she? And you're gonna be forced to buy it. You're not gonna be able to say no. You're gonna be forced to buy something here. May I help you? We're interested in purchasing some elaborate jewelry. First of all, you're writing checks that my ass can't cash. I have a diamond bracelet for 50,000. A diamond ring for 30,000. You love rings. You love rings. You told me just the other day, oh, I never want to get a bracelet. Rings? That's much more our speed. Neither? Nah. I feel like if we say neither here, she might get so pissed that we, like, get divorced and it game overs. I feel like we have to buy something. I'll buy the ring. Thank you, honey. I feel like we're not allowed to say no there. She might get so pissed that we like game over and get divorced. <laughs> we can't take that chance. Not when we're so close. We can't take that chance. Yeah, I'm learning a lot about marriage today. What you don't know for the people in the chat room that aren't married is that when you get married, over your spouse, immediately there will be, like, a marriage meter, and you'll see it go down when you fuck up. And you have to manage it for the rest of your life. If you don't see one, it's probably because you're not married yet. You have to manage your marriage meter. It's rough, dude. 
That's true facts. It's it's true facts. Okay, we need to sell. Hypothetically, yo Mayo Cats. Marriage is your wife breaking the car every other week and you having to buy a new one. <laughs> the breaking the car every other week. Just like a comically bad driver keeps bonking into trees, you have to get it buffed out. <laughs> no, I don't like this car anymore. I've already crashed it. Get a new one. <laughs> Yo, Raycat, who dat? If you aren't careful, they'll hit you with the level three. I'm fine. <laughs> Thank you. The I'm fine, that's the OS. No, you know the real OS, it's when it's like, is something wrong? No, nothing's wrong. Five second beat. I just think it's funny how... <laughs> You're cooked, dude. As soon as you get hit with, I just think it's funny. Nah, you're cooked. That's it's over for you. You're done. Okay, who's up right now? Cryer is still up. Stray Hound, Terra dying, Pan Mam Airlines, Bethlehem Steel. Cryer made us a lot of money earlier. Okay. Hypothetically, let's do some fake math here. If we already paid for 10% of the castle, we only need to spend another, like, 180,000-ish. And if we do have to pay off the loan, that means we need to be somewhere, like, 2.6 mil, 2.7 mil. Just in case we do have to pay the loan... 1.8, sorry, sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. Somewhere around there. Just in case we do actually have to pay off the loan after buying the castle. Yo, it's a rainy boy. We're almost at the end of Wall Street, kid. I'm buying Cryer shares. I can't hold that many of them, but it's just been climbing and climbing all day. I would be a fool not to take advantage of this opportunity. I think Bethlehem Steel was also on that leaderboard, so we'll buy two of those two. And we still have some time. Go shopping. We'll go shopping. We'll go swimming. We're closed! Not the pool! I'm ruined! I can't go swimming! Tomorrow. Tomorrow for sure. Let's go! Made 80,000. Interest rates have risen by 0.5%. Someone peed in the pool! Dude, have you seen the scene in... Is it's always sunny in Philadelphia where Danny DeVito goes on the water slide. <laughs> it's I think it's the most horrifying scene I've ever seen on television. I can't think of anything more unpleasant than that scene. Yo, Reg! You're a lucky raccoon. Dino, please, marrying a beautiful woman such as Pris. May your children be healthy. Oh, nose mug. Thank you. I'll do my best. Ultimo! Oh no, all these stocks are a gateway to Vegas stakes or Vegas dreams. Vegas who? Vegas what? Vegas who? You're making, the, you're making stuff up. You're making games up. We'd never play that. No way, get real. Play Minnesota Fats again. Let's go. Oh, 
Why'd I have those on deck? Why'd I have what on deck? You're imagining things. Cryer is still number two. Zrox is the top stock. Yesterday had the biggest gain. Tick Abundance attacks family on hiking grounds. I will go to the carnival with my lovely wife. Damn, we almost made a hundred thousand there. <laughs> it's X Eero X. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Another gangster shoot up at a downtown tavern after big brawl. No injuries reported. Are we stinking rich yet? I think we have enough money to. We have enough money to buy the castle for sure. The question is do we have enough money to pay the loan and the castle? I think we do. I think we do, don't we? Okay. How much is the rest of the castle? It's like 180k, right? Let's... okay. After this week, once it's the next week, we're gonna cash out... We're gonna cash out the stocks, we're gonna pay off the loan, and then we should still have enough left over... Yeah, it's like 1.8 mil. The loan is 840,000. It's like 1.8 mil left for the castle, because we bought 10% of it. I think we're good. I think we're pretty much good. We could have more money, true. Ha! Huh? Who's calling that phone? Hi, honey! I'm so excited about the party tomorrow. Don't forget to bring the cash for the payment, honey. Huh? The what? The hmm? What money? Hmm? You didn't mention this. Did you run this by me first? What's, uh... What we... What's... Payment for what, honey? Are you sure? All right, I'll sell my stocks. <laughs> How much is this? Why didn't we why didn't we talk this out first like a family? What's going on? It was the thing at the start. Yeah, you're probably right. Oh, it was the 10k. Oh, yeah, 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 true. Well, I Helium was up. Feathers were down. Paper was stationary. Oh no. Fluorescent tubing was dimmed in light trading. <laughs> Knives were up sharply. Pencils lost a few points. Hiking equipment was trailing. Elevators rose, while escalators continued their slow decline. Weights were up in heavy trading. You deserve this. Great Smash Brawl! Thanks to the stonks, I got this nice golden kappa. Let's go! Thank you, habitual half-stepper, for the 100 puns. Thank you, Ray Smash Brawl, for the 100 kappas. Okay. We have enough to pay the loan. We have enough to pay the loan for sure, so we might as well do it just in case we have to. Pay auction. Oh, can I do that now? I can just pay it right now, huh? Ah, that's fine. Loan payment. Yeah, I'll pay off the loan. And then we'll just... We're just... We're, just, we're not gonna spend anything today. No spending today. We're good. Keep the cash on hand for the party. What a successful party. I agree. Wanna dance? Sure! After you, dear. Good. Excellent. <laughs> Who's peeping out that window? I agree. <laughs> okay, so we have to buy the castle by the 28th. We've got a few days left. We can build money. We already have the money that we needed. 
the the castle was what two million twenty thousand. We already have enough, but we might as well get some superfluous money first. Hello, this is Ruth at the bank. I'm just calling to remind you that you must pay off the balance on the castle by no later than Friday, July 28th. Yeah, we already paid 10% of it, so it shouldn't be full price. We, we can probably... we need like 1.8 mil-ish. So this is kind of just the victory lap, then. We already have all the money we need. It's just how much more can we make before the deadline. Why is it we need to keep making money? True. There we go. Big gains, baby. <laughs> Been reports of dangerously defective chemicals to all pool owners. It's all right. I'm going on a hike instead. Here I go. Was this meant for children to play? No. Yo, Armoshi! I think we're about 19 whole years! No, it's like, obviously not. <laughs> we mustn't assume that every video game was made with a children audience in mind. Especially any of Sofell's games. They also made fucking Casino Kid? Money Game 1? Nah, there's no way, dude. <laughs> the cover doesn't scream made for adults to you. Here is the Japanese box art. Uh, where'd I put it? Where is the... Uh, huh? That's the Japanese box art. Now how do you feel? Does that seem like it's more for adults to you? It's a guy about to lose his job, yeah. Where's the money game one? Right here. That's money game one. This one never left Japan, so... We, we, we had to skip this one. Damn, we just made a ton of money! Just in case the game auto-completes on, like, the 28th, I'm gonna cash out today. We're gonna cash out now. And the loan is already paid off. We should be good to go. We have nothing else to do... ...other than go shopping with wife. <laughs> One mil is in the wall! There I go. Alright, this is the day. Did we beat Wall Street Kid? Let's find out. Good morning, this is Ruth at the bank. The balance on your castle is due today. The balance on your castle is due today. Could you imagine somebody telling you this on the phone? <laughs> if we don't receive the payment by 5 p.m. today, we'll have to foreclose all of your property. I got it, miss. Don't sweat it. I got you. I'll pay it. It's fine. Yeah, all of it. Pay auction. Would you like to pay off the balance of the castle? Yes, ma'am. 
and we still have 400k left over. We've received your final payment on the castle. Thank you for using our bank. Congratulations! You've succeeded in carrying out the Benedict legacy. Now everything is yours. All yours! You've proven your ability to successfully run a marriage, money, and a social environment. To top it off, you've carried out the last wishes of a dying man. You are a real Benedict. Let's go! Oh! <laughs> we have all the money! Honey, you're so good! I married the best! Good job, your uncle would have been proud. Well, I bet you couldn't do it again. You've made it, yeah! You've really walled your way through this game. Tell me about it. Are you ready to buy more mansions? Celebration on the most luxurious yacht? How about some larger pets? I can quit my work and become your chauffeur. Why don't you stop by my new showroom? You're a successful artist indeed. Impressive, need any designer underwear? Congratulations, you're a real gem. Attend more auctions, I'll bid you welcome. Yes. We've cleared Wall Street, kid. Sniff. Sniff. It smells like broken here. <laughs> it smells- Hey, we still got 400k, we're good. No questions at the CIA outfit with matching briefcase. We played the stonk market. True. There was some ort in there. Hold on, let me scroll up to the ort. Yeah, thank you, Skolionich, for the 100 bits. Thank you, Habitual Half-Stepper, for the 100 bits. <laughs> Stock data and instructions. I was not 100% sure that we were gonna clear this today. I'm glad we did. I was pretty certain we were gonna get like hard walled somewhere, but we we made it we made it work. <laughs> All right, what is this? Or his <laughs> mood, Sam. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. He we we die. I mean, how many times did we accidentally get like chlorine poisoning during that stream? We kept not reading the news that told us not to go to the pool, and we just kept. <laughs> yeah, it was like three or four times just accidentally just drinking chlorine. Oops, that's fine. Yo, thank you, Dragon Catman, for the incredible art. Oh, it is Barry with my. Uh, it is Barry me with my money. I just noticed. Oh, that's so sick. <laughs> Thank you. Why am I drinking pool water? Do you not? It's delicious. It's delicious and nutritious. Probably. Sofell. What a video game. Wall Street Kid? Huge fan. Big, enormous, huge fan. Dino's dead? <laughs> yeah. I do wish that we could play Money Game 1. Usually with games that I can't read, usually I'm content to just, like, throw myself at it and just brute force all the menus until I figure out how it works, but... A Stonks game seems a little... That seemed like it'd be a tall order, so we just kind of skipped to the one we could read. That's okay. What do we do now? I think there's only one sane thing to do after having gotten all that money. And that's to lose it in Vegas by playing Vegas Dream. I think that's the only sane thing we could possibly do. Is to pivot to gambling and just immediately lose all that money. <laughs> it's just the only way. 
Here I go. This is a HAL laboratory joint, by the way. <laughs> Vegan dream. Vegas dream, HAL America 1988. Vegas dream? One spot? Well, we gotta try the Vegas dream. Put me in, coach. Name entry? Here I go. Mr. Mr. Dino, please. Eh, eh, eh. Excellent. Perfect. Blackjack, roulette, slot machine, Kino? Kino is like the most hands-off game, right? It just it's just it just picks numbers. <laughs> right. I'm gonna go to Kino first. Applications for the next game are now available. Select any numbers. Select numbers 1 to as many as 15. Okay. So as far as I'm aware, we have to bet on, like, uh, we have to pick a certain amount of things that'll come up. We have to pick a certain amount of numbers that'll get called, like, bingo style. And how many of them have to actually hit in order to get paid? Like, over half of them? It tells us that we can pick as many as 15, but... I don't think we're supposed to take 15. We're supposed to pick like four of them, like four or five. Give me five, give me seven, 69, 57, and give me a, give me a, give me a 25. That's a nice round number. 50 bucks. I don't see any way this backfires. The winning numbers will be announced! Oh, we hit one! Oh, we hit another one! Oh, shit! Cool. We made a hundred bucks there. Because we got over half of our numbers called... Cool. Uh, get me out. How do I just get me, get me out of Kino? Get me the hell out, Blackjack. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it's sick. A hundred bucks. One hundo. Seven. King. What is the house? What do they stand on? Do they stand on 16 or 17? Well, I gotta stand. Fifteen? Twenty-two, let's go! We're so back. Eight fifty? Another... another hundo. King? Deuce! Not the... not the... not the king deuce. Not like this. I'm gonna hit. Check this out. Watch this nine. Oh! I'll stay. I'll stick. <laughs> Let's go, 15. Yes! Mmm, feels good. Mr. Dino, did you know that there's a wonderful show tonight? How about going together? Huh? Expartan me. Whomst? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Oh, that's great. You mean you'll escort me? Let's go. It's already beginning. She's gonna rob me, isn't she? Oh! We went to the show! <laughs> Me tricking Dino into hanging out. Here's the news. Last night at the show at the Hal Palace Hotel, Mr. Dino won the raffle and received a prize of $10,000! I'm out of here. I'm out of here. See you later. We're going to roulette, baby. 
We're hitting that roulette. Spend it all on frog races. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. 100 on 5. 100 on 7. 100 on the space between 5 and 7. 100 for the first 12. 100 for red. 100 for odd. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Run it. I did not hit- I hit red, that's all I hit. 34? I barely hit any of these. I hit red, that's all I hit. That cost me like 500, I made like 100 back. Win? I'm not sure that I won. You're free to claim that I did. Five thousand on black twenty six. I'll put a th I, I'll put four hundred dollars. I'm gonna put four hundred on double zero just for you. Check this out. Watch me hit this double zero. Guaranteed. Check this out. Watch me hit this shit. Guaranteed. Never mind. We didn't hit shit, boys. Could you imagine? Man, this, uh, this does not scroll any faster. This is the top speed of the roulette table. It really was 34 a second time. That's crazy. <laughs> you keep calling shots, you'll eventually get it. I'm going, I'm sticking with my guns. 100 on 5, 100 on 7, 100 here. First 12, red, odd, run it. I didn't hit anything. That was black. We're fucking bankrupt. Yo, habitual half-stepper. Put 500 on red and black. I... I feel like... <laughs> I feel like we wouldn't gain anything if we did that. It's a guaranteed win, that's true. It's also a guaranteed loss at the same time. I'm hitting the slots, baby. 100 per pull? Jackpot bar? 100 per pull, I'm ready. Oh, baby. Run it. Lemon? That's a shame. Another one. What if we hit triple sevens, though? Could you imagine? It's a hundred per line, yep. Ultimo! Yup, this is how our slots usually go in my casino. <laughs> yeah! I forgot you work at a casino, yeah. Thank you for the 100 bits. Ultimo, how do I rig this? Yo, triple lemons! Never mind, we're so back. Cherry is like a guaranteed payout every time, right? Maybe not a big one, but... Why did a cop show up? I th it probably cuts to like a random spectator when we hit it big. Now this is gaming. This is what I call gaming right here. This is what it's all about. Yo, what's up, Koji? A frog race got redeemed. Oh! Ah. Uh. Yeah, frog. We gotta do the frog race. Let me let me try to win another one of these. Yeah, the real BBO games. Don't be so frightened. I've been watching you for a while. Hmm? 
You're really lucky, aren't you? May I join you? Have you been... Are you sure that I'm... Have you been... Have we been... Have you been, like, paying attention? Because I'm on a cold streak here. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, I'm so happy that I met you like this. I am... She... Th this person is going to rob me. It's almost time for me to go, but will you see me again? Uh sure. I don't know what we just did. It's Lady Luck. I'm so happy that we could meet again. Mr. Dino, I think I've fallen in love with you. Will you take me as your partner for life? This is progressing very speedily. Are we? <laughs> what do we what do we think? <laughs> I'm sorry. I do think we should see other people. How could you play around with my feelings? I'm sorry, ma'am. I do think we should see other people. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just here for the slots. What the fuck? Did she snatch a grand? No, that's just me uh, draining all my money into the slot machine. Oh, she did? Okay, fair enough. It threw away the real jackpot. Oh? Uh, another one. This is the predecessor to Vegas Stakes, correct. Let's go! Alright, hold that thought. Game change. Let's go back to Blackjack. But before we actually do anything, let's uh, do the frog race. Place your bets now. <laughs> we haven't known each other long. Will you take me as your viewer for life? I would be... I would be honored... to have you view the streams. Streamer is a fake? Maybe. We'll never know for sure. Betting time is almost over. Betting time has closed. It looks like real Dino trapped in frog body. Favored to win 35%. Akuma with mocap by Ernie Reyes Sr. 28%. Best of luck, everyone. Frog number two has the lead. Frog number three speeds away, though. Suwako gets there first. I cannot believe. They just... They just made an insane beeline for the end. What a come-from-behind victory. Pay it out. Frog number three. 332,000 new yen given to 18 lucky winners. Congratulations to the 18 of you. My condolences for everybody else. <laughs> You're guessing I'm not very athletic given this result. Uh, my legal team has suggested I don't answer that question. 500. Oh, God. Deuce King, please help. Stop. Apparently, if you married her, there's a 50-50 where she would either permanently increase your cash flow or rob you. I think she still robbed us, even if we- even though we said no. Ooh, 20! Let's go, dude! Palm treetop!
Thank you for the seven whole years. This game progresses very slowly. Yeah, finally, some new yen. I got a hit on 13, but I don't want to hit on 13. I kind of have to. Because if they hit until 17, then, like, if they have a king or, like, a 10, they can just stand and they win. That seems about right. I would like to go back to the slot machine. Oh, interesting. They play even if... They, like, keep going even if you are over. Money change? Oh, it lets me swap it, so if I'm doing, like, a four-player game, I can... <laughs> I can give money to the other players! <laughs> That's pretty good. Pot o' gold? What's the pot o' gold? It only costs one dollar. I don't know about this. It's one dollar. And so the real DNO returns to his 8-bit terrarium to ponder what is going on in the real world. Little did he know he was the lucky one. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. Nah, these stakes? These stakes are too low. Slot machine, what is the jackpot bar? Oh, interesting. I get to pay up to a hundred. Wow, we actually almost hit that shit, huh? Oh, baby. Oh, baby, I can feel it. We're gonna hit one of these, and it's gonna be glorious. But apparently that day's not today. Yeah, we're in the machine zone. Considering we got $10,000 for free, I don't particularly mind being really frivolous with it. Right? Give me these. These are the slots I want. It's just the one coin. I know that this game has, like, an ending sequence. I don't know how much money we need to get there, though. The chance of us doing it's pretty sl uh, pretty low. Hello, Mr. Dino. Sorry to bother you. Would you like a game? I want to test your skill. Sure. Great, how about a game of blackjack? Word? Oh my god. <laughs> right now? Uh, $2,000. I can gamble while I gamble? Let's fucking go. I gotta stand on 18, I think. You don't have 20. 13? 18. It was a draw. It was a push. Now what do we do? Oh, you just go again. Okay, fair enough. 19! I'll take that. I'll take a 19. I'll stand on that. Aha! Fantastic! Nice move! I'm impressed. I lose. Okay. Now, what did that accomplish? <laughs> Other than, like, we just briefly detoured to Blackjack.
We're gonna hit triple sevens at some point. I can feel it. It's gonna be delicious. Oh! Lemon? Ah, oh, that's a shame. a blue lemon. So close. What do you think are the chances of Triple Seven showing up in this game? Do you think they programmed it to show up eventually? What are all these pings on Discord? Hold on. There's like a million pings on Discord. Okay, we're good. That's a plum? Oh, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, <laughs> I want your social security number, yeah. The three wacky digits on the back, is it? Game stop? Oh, you get a password. Okay, so the game lets you kind of save your progress then. Wait a minute. So that you're probably intended to, like, use this to checkpoint your progress so that you can get up to 10 mil. So we probably have to, cle we probably have to keep, like, writing these passwords down and then making really dumb big bets so that we eventually end up at the 10 mil we need. Hold on, I need to keep- I need to make note of this fucking password. I think that's what we're intended to do. I think we're supposed to go, like, max bet all the time. Yeah, we have to get to, like, 10 mil. So we have to just, like, try- keep doubling up. <laughs> <laughs> and just put in the password when we lose? Is that how this game is played? That gives me 11? This is good. Let's go. Yeah, at least it's like a normal password. And it's like... It's long, but not that long compared to what we saw earlier. Game stop. Hold on, I just gotta keep screenshotting my password. And then we could absolutely just... <laughs> ...keep running this shit. Blackjack seems like the most reliable way to get money, but I so badly want to hit triple seven on the slot machine. I don't think it's ever going to happen. But maybe, if you dream high enough into the sky, there's a chance. Tell you one thing, it's nice to have some different music after we've been hearing like the one tune all day. Mr. Dino, did you know there's a wonderful show tonight? How about going together? Well, this got me like 10,000 bucks last time. Why not? This time we lose a kidney. Here's the news. Last night at the show at the Hal Palace Hotel, Mr. Dino won the raffle and received $10,000. Let's fucking go. Hold on, let me get the new password. I gotta screenshot my password when we make progress. <laughs> it's the only way we're gonna get to the end of this game.
Seven. Uh... There is an ending. If we get like ten million dollars, yeah. That's gonna require a lot of password <laughs> inputting, I imagine. Because we're gonna try to keep doubling up. And then we're gonna fucking miss and we're gonna have to put the password in. I'm sure of it. We can force game overs. Well, if we just go to Blackjack and we go all in, and then we lose, we can see a game over screen. Let's try it. Let me just go all in. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Oh my god, I'm allowed to just bet everything. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Yo, Buttlet, thank you for the follow. Jormungounder, thank you for the follow. Fourteen? This is, uh, very bad. Insurance? Nah, I'm good. Hit! I'm ruined! This kind of works, though, because I want to see the game over screen. <laughs> Mr. Dino! Oh no! You're penniless! Mr. Dino, I'm sorry, but your luck seems to end right here. Don't feel so bad. Las Vegas never sleeps. It's always waiting for you. But, then again, Las Vegas is also a city that sells dreams. We'll give you another chance to go home a winner. Remember, though, this is your last chance. Go ahead, pull the lever. Or cooked. Do we get a cool game over screen? Let me see. <laughs> We gotta go back to the airport! <laughs> Yo, hit the bricks, buddy! It was worth it. <laughs> that was worth it. Hold on, let me... Uh, I screen capped that password. Hold on. Fake stream. Continue. We're gonna have to put in passwords a lot, I fear. If we intend to see the end of this video game, we are gonna need to put in some passwords. Eh. T. Here's a quarter, Fats. Get out of town. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank you for the quarter, Soul Survivor. Uh, 7K U J. These passwords are still pretty long. Q F 9 T. 7k. I wish I had 97k. Eh, eh. Eh. And then, eh. And then 4g43. Good. Thank you. Going right back to the slots, though. Guaranteed, we're hitting triple sevens. Don't you worry, we're gonna hit that shit. Let's go! Or maybe they're content to just give us lots of lemons. And that's just where we live, we're just in lemon world, where all we get is lemons. Let's go! Oh, big! It seems to me like the greatest money gain is easily blackjack. Unless you make a really stupid bet in, like, roulette and you hit that shit. Like, if I put a thousand dollars on five and seven. Here I go. I'm gonna bet on all my usual. 21, <laughs> let it ride. Now it's gotta be five and seven, dude. We didn't hit either of those. We did hit red, but that's about all we hit. 
We got an odd red number. That gives us some amount. I don't think we won back what we paid. We didn't hit the space between five and seven, it's fine. Four thousand! We made roughly back what we put in. Roughly. Yeah, we lost about a thousand. It wasn't too bad. Good evening, Mr. Dino. Don't be so frightened. I've been watching you for a while. You're really lucky, aren't you? May I join? We're gonna marry her this time. We're gonna marry her. We're gonna see what happens. Yeah, you again. It's almost time for me to go. Will you see me again? Certainly. We're gonna get robbed. I can already feel it. Legally binding matrimony. I don't think we hit anything we just bet on. All we hit was an odd number. Oh, wait a minute. Looks like it does let me go a little faster. Oh, we canceled, though. We canceled it before we got paid. Well, I think we lost most of our shit, though, anyway. I guess it's fine. I was trying to find a way to fast forward, but, uh... That is not in the cards. That's fine. We hit an odd red number. Yeah, we bailed before getting paid. Roulette could pay out well. Overall, Blackjack is probably the most reliable. Why does the money increment so slowly? <laughs> it's like it goes up so slow. Makes you feel like you just won a lot of money. They get married again. Unfortunately, we accidentally canceled before we got to see the conclusion of that random event. What if I open menu and then go to return? No, okay. So there is no way to skip the scrolling of the screen like this. You are forced to watch the entire ritual. Mr. Dino, I have something interesting to sell you, or to tell you. This is not quite the right place. How about we move to the lounge? Well, you see, just between the two of us, there's a great deal on stocks that might interest you. Oh, baby. $200 each. You got it. Yeah, that's the way to go. And how many do you want to buy? All of them. My whole bankroll. Take it. There's a message from the Silverman Sachs brokerage firm. We've been entrusted with the sale of Mr. Dino's stocks, but due to an unexpected drop in the stock market today, we unfortunately had to sell the stock at half the original price. Watch out, DNO. Barbon is watching and is reporting to right now. Oh. He, the TTS did not say Mr. X at all. Yeah, idiot doesn't know how to hold. Here you go. Take all my money. I'm gonna put it on five. Check this shit out. Is this newsworthy in Vegas? No. Altason, thank you for the 100 bits. We did not hit that five. All right, let's put in that password. We're gonna have to reset. Password get. Vegas dream, continue. There is no... there is no way to speed this up. I fear. Eh. Eh. 
Eller hur? Hä? Ja, yeah, you are being followed. 7KUJ E uh, Yeah, we need a keyboard for this. I understand why it's so long, because you have to have, like, a different password for each possible, like, amount of money you could be at. So it's like, I kinda get it, but goddamn. No, not insert. There we go. E. It's pretty chunky, though. Lemon. One coin. What can I do with this one coin? I should make a slot machine where you physically win whatever's on the slots. I agree. There's a lot of lemons in that slot machine. We almost hit two rows of lemons, that would have been sick. We thread the needle there. Yeah, it seems to me like our best bet by far is Blackjack. It's the only game where you can kinda influence... ...what happens. <laughs> right? 16 is pretty grim, though. Alright. I think we stand and we pray that they fuck up. Pretty much. Ten? Twenty! Alright. I'm glad I didn't bet all my money, or we'd have to put in that password again. I mean, I'm still pretty much cooked. But let's see. Another 16, I'm ruined. Hit! Good news. You don't have to hear Buffalo every minute for eight hours in this game. <laughs> Buffalo. I guess that's true. 20! I'm so cooked. Alright, back it up. It'd probably be much wiser to just save a state on the password screen instead of actually manually writing the password. That feels like a wise choice. That way we can skip this entire ritual. Eh. Into E6. 1T. Thank you for the 100 Buffaloes, Ultimo. K-U-J. In putting the passwords part of the gameplay loop, that is your penance for bankrupting yourself. You're kind of right. Five and seven have to hit eventually, right? Like, there's no way that they would go this... There's no way they wouldn't hit eventually. Right? They have to hit. Alright, we didn't hit anything. <laughs> skip password, might as well skip to YouTubing the credits. I would never. No, we're gonna earn those credits. Although we may skip the password inputting ritual to do so. No, exploits? Nah, it's not for me. That sounds like baby bitch coward shit. 
I... I spun the wheel without putting anything in play? I'm pretty sure nothing happens, because I didn't bet anything. <laughs> it just rolled for no gain from anybody. Game change. I'm going back to blackjack. All right, uh, let's go to GameStop. I'll save a state right here, and then we'll just back that up instead of putting in the password. Save some amount of time that way. Yeah, you can go to GameStop in this, it's insane. Twelve! What am I- what am I meant to do with twelve? Other than press a hit and then get Delta Nine! Check this out! Eh. Alright, fair enough. You got me fair and square. Well, we both busted. <laughs> what happens now? I'm still bankrupt. I have $90 to my name. Alright, we're gonna have to back that up. Let's <laughs> back that up to our password screen. The jackpot bar, check this shit out. I assume this one pays out the most, but it probably hits the least because you only get one line. Hey-o! I take it back. Maybe the jackpot bar isn't so bad. <laughs> yeah, he's judging us with weapon in hand. You've won too many times. We're gonna have to throw you out of this casino. Mr. Dino. Excuse me, but could you change this $5 bill? Uh, sure. Alright, thanks a lot. From the Hal Palace Hotel to Mr. Dino, we have an apology for you. As an expression of apology for what happened last night, we would like you to accept this gift of $500. I don't understand what happened. What was the incident? Was it counterfeit? What happened? Was it fake money? Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Did fraud happen in some way? It's unclear. Yeah, that makes sense. No. Yeah, the incident. If I get three blank spaces, I should still get paid out for that. Yo, Mayo Cats! We apologize for having sent someone to make you magically transform a $5 bill. <laughs> Here is $500 dollars as compensation. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Mayo Cats, for the $500 dollars. Jackpot! Oh, that's a shame. Wait, I still got paid out for that? So if you hit the jackpot bar, like, no matter what, it pays out? Alright, now we gotta go back to Blackjack. Blackjack's the only way we're getting to the end of this game. Let's see. Game stop. Uh, save. Bill breaking is illegal unless it's at the cashier. It's considered theft. Oh, I see. Ultimo does work at a casino, so Ultimo has insight that I did not have into the situation. Thank you, I learned something.
I learned something today. 15k! I'm not thrilled with the with the soft 16 I have. Now I've got 12. Yeah, I have 12. That's not great either. No, I have uh, 14. Yeah, I have a 14. I mean, I still have to hit. 18? Stay. Okay. We've accomplished nothing. <laughs> Your Honor, I gave him five and quarters. Hello, Mr. Dino. Sorry to bother you. Would you like a game? I want to test your skill. Great, how about a game of I'm already playing blackjack? I'm already at the blackjack table. Bruh. Finally, a game that lets me play blackjack while I play blackjack. What a concept. 16? Uh, I'm hitting on 16! Huh! Oh! Let's go! Cool. The <laughs> luck of this guy! Hold on, we need a new password. What we're doing instead of putting in passwords is we save every time that we have access. We're saving state on the password screen. That's about as close to legit as we can make this. While still keeping, uh... While still preserving time that would be spent putting in the password. Soft... 16. Your favorite streamer is cheating. It's actually not. The game lets it happen. We're just saving time. We interrupt this broadcast of gambling to bring you some breaking news. Rickon from Cleveland cannot math in Las Vegas. True. 20? I'll take a 20 thing for the 100 raccoons, Ridge. You don't have a blackjack. You don't got the guts. Thank God. Now, if the game allows the... The game, if anything, probably encourages saves coming by giving you access to the password at any time. We're just saving state on the password screen. That way we don't have to punch it in when we inevitably go bankrupt. <laughs> Roulette. This is our moment. This is the one right here. Check this out. This is the big one. 2K. 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 This is the one right here. Guaranteed. <gasps> I did not hit a 5 or a 7, but I did hit a low, even red. So we probably still profited there. We hit a low, odd red number, yeah. <laughs> the Vegas Dream community will never accept this as a valid run. I'm ruined! They'll survive, I'm sure. It'll be alright. Another one. Just 1k. Just 1,000. I don't have that much confidence in this plan. Okay. That was black 15? 60k on red. We would have been finished if we had done that just now. We would have been ruined! Now nah, we're gonna go back to blackjack, I think. We only made 2k. That's not terrible, I suppose. Put it all on 21! Tell you what. 
You're so right. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna say- give me a password. Give me a password right now. And then we'll save right here. And then I'm gonna put it all on 21. And if it doesn't hit 21, you're all fired. I got bad news, chat. Yeah, pack your bags. Give me your uh, your gun, your badge, on my desk by the end of the day. Sorry, let's back that up. <laughs> it's a 21 if you squint. Yeah. So what we're gonna do every time we load the game, here's what I'm thinking. I assume that because we save state but to, to skip putting in the password, I'm assuming that the game like plays out the same way every time. So every time we do have to load, we're gonna switch games so as not to like <laughs> cheat the RNG. Sixteen. I'm not thrilled with the 16. I'm gonna stand, though, because they are gonna draw, like... That's not- that's not gonna be a face card, and then they're gonna bust. Check this out. 14? 24? Let's go! I'm filthy stinking rich. So we need 10 mil. We're like, we're getting there though, because once we, once we're at the one million dollar mark, then it becomes extremely easy to just bet like a million at a time. Yeah, like 35 games of blackjack. The game just lets you bet everything you have. So really, it wouldn't take that long. <laughs> it wouldn't take that long, really. Going to the jackpot bar. I gotta hit a jackpot, dude. We gotta hit- I gotta hit a jackpot. For my own sanity. You just gotta hit it, dude. Wait. Wait. Wrong one. This one. We gotta hit a triple seven, dude. What happens? I don't think this is- I don't think we're gonna see it. I don't think it's possible. <laughs> I don't think they programmed triple seven into the game. <laughs> Sadly, the slots just stop of their own accord. You cannot press the button to force them to stop. So there is no, like, timing aspect of skill here. You just pull the lever and it goes. Seven more blackjack double ups. That's not that bad, actually. But I also kind of want to fuck around a bit to see if we can get more of the, like, random encounters. I don't know if we've seen them all yet. <laughs> I'm curious what else can happen. My lemons! Oh! Ah, oh, that's a shame. I'll take the bells, though. Oh, look at the payout on the bells, dude. Did I hit a jackpot? I have no idea. Oh, big. We hit three bells, I'll take that. Let's go! 
Yo, Reg! Just a reminder, chat, to play responsibly. I am not a professional gambler. I cannot impart you with any gambling advice, nor can I condone gambling irresponsibly with your money. But for the bit, 90% of all gamblers quit just before they hit it big. Just don't be a statistic, is all I'm saying. Could be you. <laughs> Modern slots gave a 90% plus return. The problem is it's 0.001% for the grand and your average win is basically enough you will come out as a loss. Mmm. I see. I am learning a lot today. <laughs> yeah, let's actually try this marriage thing. Let's try the marriage scene. I'm curious what happens. Yeah, thank you, Ultimo. Thank you, Reg, for the 100 bits. I will see you again. What happens? Do they double my money? Or am I gonna get robbed? I'm so happy we could meet again. I think I've fallen in love with you. Will you take me as your partner for life? Yes, certainly. Oh, I'm thrilled that you'll take me for your wife. It's just that easy, by the way. You just go to the casino. There's just wives falling from the sky. They're just everywhere. Let's go! Here's the news. Mr. Dino was the victim of marriage fraud and has been swindled out of $200. The police are still after the criminal. I only lost 200. Bro, I lost $200? Dude, I wipe my ass with $200. Just keep it. You can have it. I don't care. Yeah, we're losing more than $200 per poll. You could have just asked me for $200. <laughs> yeah, the wedding cost more than that. Not in Vegas, it didn't. <laughs> in a few spins, she's gonna show up. <laughs> he might be right. I want that triple seven so bad. I want it so bad, you have no idea. I don't think it's I don't think it's destined to happen. Alright, let's go to- oh! Did you know there's a wonderful show tonight? How about going together? We have not had this go badly yet. I assume there's a way for you to lose money by going to the show here. I'm not sure how bad it gets. I don't know if we're gonna get, like, half our money stolen. Last night, there was a theft at the Hal Palace Hotel. The victim, Mr. Dino, lost $62,745, which was taken during the show. Fair enough. That's what happens, man. It's rough out there. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, back to the slots anyway. <laughs> Game changed. Let's go to Kino. Oh my gosh! Presumably, we can get a huge payout if we only bet one number and we hit it. Damn it! Right? So if I bet like 50k, then we hit 69. We should get paid out pretty well. I 
I don't know if we're hitting it. I don't think we're hitting 69, boys. We didn't hit it. I'm ruined. You get paid three to one if you bet on one number and it hits. That's not too bad. All right, let's back that up because we lost like all our fucking money. Uh, Damn this it. one? This puts me where? Oh, that puts me at the 60k that we were at. Okay, fair enough. Blackjack. Blackjack is the clear best way to make money in this game. By a, by a massive margin. The 18 wasn't bad in that case because they were showing a 7, which means at most they would have had an 18 themselves if they had an ace. Alright, let's drop another save here. Here I go. Only save via the password screen. Check this shit out. It's time, dude. It's time. I'm gonna bet big. 10k on 5. 10k on 7. On the first 12, red, odd, I got 10k on all this shit. 1 to 18? We're hitting those. We're gonna hit all these. Put 1 on 15, I got you. $1 on 15. <laughs> Just for you. Watch this shit. I'm gonna go bankrupt immediately. We hit red, and we hit an odd number. We hit some of it, but not much. <laughs> yeah, come on, Chris. Rig the wheel for us. It would have been funny if we hit that 15. Yeah. Dear God. It cannot increment any faster than that. Help. <laughs> There's no way to make that go any faster. Another one. We're so due. We're so due for this to hit. It's unreal how due we are. Fast forward? Uh, technically, yes. But I have no desire to press it. Yo, there's the 15. Alright, we're gonna have to back this up. <laughs> we, just, we done lost all our money. Let's back that up. Kino. Kino is back. Watch this shit. Test the RNG hypothesis. What, that it plays out the same way because we're saving state? I can't prove that that happens. It just feels like it might. So I feel the best way to avoid any potential cheating is to just switch games on load. We did not hit it! I'm bankrupt! That's fine. No harm done. Yeah, back to the airport. <laughs> back to the boing! <laughs> we were probably wise not to take any stock, to take any shares of boing. <laughs> True, whiskey. True. You never know. This could be the pull. I mean, it very clearly wasn't, but the next pull, though. You know, what if this is the one? <laughs> 
triple lemons. <laughs> the D.O. sends you right back to the airport. Caesar's Palace? When I was a kid, I had Caesar's Palace for the PS1. Like, it wasn't for me, but it was, like, in the house. Maybe I should stream that at some point. May I ask you a favor? Will you lend me $200? What do you think? Should we give Ukiyo Tachibana $200? What do we think? And... <laughs> You see, I lost so much. Yeah, okay, take it. Thank you, Mr. Dino. I'll never forget your kindness. Here's the news. Last night, there was a theft at the Hal, pa uh, Hal Palace Hotel. The victim lent some money to a woman who disappeared with it. The amount was reported to be $200. I mean, it's 200 I don't care. Keep it. Why is the news in your business? I have no idea. Yeah, we were asked for $200. I'm not sure what's theft about it. They, I mean, they just asked us for a favor. Let's get a password here. Let's try and double up at Blackjack. Can we double up? Is such a thing even possible? Can we hit these? Deuce? Deuce of four. I'm not thrilled with this. I have eight. Can I get 18? I have to stand on 18. Fifteen? Twenty-five, let's go! <laughs> Dino stonks, Benedict. Alright, that calls for a new password. Eh. Save. Eh. Cool. This time, for sure. We're so due for five or seven to hit. It's unreal how do we are for these numbers to hit. This time for sure. I didn't hit anything. I hit zero of what I picked. <laughs> 29? I hit odd, that's all I hit. I, uh, let's just back that up. We're finished. I'll never emotionally recover from this, let alone financially. But it's okay, because this time we're gonna hit that 69. We're gonna hit this, we're gonna hit it. I got 200,000 on 69. Watch this shit. And 20, yeah. <laughs> 70! I can't believe it. I can't believe this. You've ruined my life. Alright, fair enough. I only pulled two lines! No! Kino seems like a very hands-off kind of a casino game. It's I'd rather play bingo, given the choice between the two. Mr. Dino, I'm sorry to bother you, sir, but there is someone to see you. 
Do you wish to meet? Uh, is it- is it the police who- Come this way, please. Watch your step. The stairs are rather steep. Here's the news. Late last night at the Hal Palace Hotel, a guest accidentally fell down the stairs. Mr. Dino will be laid up for two weeks. <laughs> Furthermore, the hospital bills reported to be $200. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this game rules. <laughs> nah, this game's sick. All right, hold on. Let me throw it over to Stampede. A poem got redeemed. Hey, Stampede. How about a poem? My heart pounds in my chest, like it wants to jump out of my mouth. Stinging sweat pours into my eyes, where it burns like Nam gel fire. We fight like mongoose and rattler, every time like the last. Only one driver drives away. Mmm, thank you, Stampede. We never did meet that person. We never met the person that apparently wanted to see us. We just died on our way to meet them, and we fell down the stairs. This game is so sick. <laughs> this game is amazing. That's what I feel. I feel like most, uh... I feel like most gambling games, they need these random encounters like this. I can't score diagonally. That's what I just learned. You can only score straight lines. Alright. Give me a password, we'll go back to Blackjack, try to double up. There we go. To the Blackjack table. Thirteen? Thirteen? That's alright, we're gonna hit this eight, check this out. Oh! Okay, fair enough. Eighteen, I'll take eighteen. If you have a face card, we win. Ten! Twenty! Oh, I'm fucked. I'm ruined. I've still got three hundred dollars. I've still got plane fare, that's good. Alright, run that back. Damn it. This time for sure. This is the one. Yes, roulette. Yes, no. Roulette. Yes. Yeah, surely this one right here? Surely this is the one. I can feel it. <laughs> Did it hit black 29 again? There ain't no way. Ain't no way it hit 29 again. I can't believe this. Alright, back it up. Basically, all we're doing with these load states is circumventing the need to input the password. Probably saves us about a minute every time. The bouncer. Kino, this is the one. Do you believe in Miracle's chat room? <laughs> we need a different spinner, I agree. It's not looking good. Fuck. Alright. Fair enough. It seems easy to lose money at a casino. You know, I'm just gonna say it. It seems like a bad use of your money. That may be a hot take. <laughs> he 
You can't shout that at the casino. I'm gonna get thrown out, dude. It's over for me. Even if we had hit a seven on the top, we cannot we cannot win diagonally with these slots. It's only straight lines. Better chance winning in a casino than getting out of Evo pools. That's true. That is probably true. <laughs> this is your bladder. You've been at the slots for over five months. All right. We're trying to do this as legit as possible by not, like, fixing the RNG in place. So we're just kind of dawdling at the slot machine to increment RNG. If that is, in fact, how the game works, I have no fucking clue. Do I really hit on 13 or Big Brain? They're showing a 6 over there, right? So they're going to flip a face card, and then they're going to have 16. But they stand on 17, and then they're going to get another face card, and they're going to bust, and we're going to win on 13. Right? That's exactly how this goes. That's definitely how this goes. No. Nah, watch this shit. <laughs> 20. <laughs> I might be a little bankrupt. The good news is I've got $700 to my name. <laughs> Alright, back that up. Another one. Soft 14. Now I have a hard 14. No, now I have a hard... Yeah, no, I have hard 14. Shit. Uh... I mean, I guess I gotta hit again. <laughs> you got me. You got me fair and square. Oh, see, they busted that. We should have stood! Can't believe it. Unbelievable. Can't believe it. How could they do this to me? On the day of my daughter's wedding. There you go. I'm gonna carpet bomb the whole area. If we carpet bomb the entire surrounding area... We've got to hit. We've got to hit those. It's not looking great. It's not looking ideal. They've ignored that corner of the board entirely. That is a statistical wonder. <laughs> I picked the one dead zone on the whole board. All right, fair enough. Sunk. I didn't sink anybody's battleship, I fear. This is the one. This is gonna hit that fucking 29 again, isn't it? No, that time it hit 35, I think. I mean, we're still boned. But we're, like, differently boned. <laughs> Alright, back it up. It was odd, that's true. We made back a solid, like, 10% of what we lost. Thank God. Alright. Our only hope of seeing the end of this game 
is to keep doubling up in blackjack. That's the only chance we have. Queen? 16. You can't do this to me. But wait, they also have a 16. And then they're gonna hit and then they're gonna bust. Nah, we don't need to hit. Check this out. Look at the advanced strats on display. Never mind, we're cooked. <laughs> advanced money losing strats. I was just kidding. I was just fooling. I was joking. It was a goof and a gaff. It was a bluff. Ah ha ha. A hee hee. I feel much better about that. Much happier with a 10 double down? Chat room. <laughs> I think we gotta do it. I think we gotta double down. No money! I got no money. You need the money to double down. Can't even afford to double down. We're cooked. 12! Well, we gotta hit again. You're gonna give me 22, aren't you? 21! Alright, fair enough. We're so back. We need a new password. Uh, save him. This time for sure. Look at all this money we got. We could easily drop like 50, we could drop like 50k on every zone that we want. It's insane how due we are to hit 5 and 7. It's crazy how due we are. We didn't hit 5 or 7. We did hit an odd red number. No, that's an even number. We barely got anything. All we hit was red! <laughs> okay, we need to load that. Kino. This time for sure. Watch this shit. It's insane how guaranteed this is to work. Not looking good. Alright, that didn't go quite the way we planned. <laughs> Fucking my Shiranui up there taking all of our money. You've something interesting to tell me? I'm already broke, friend. Let's do it anyway. Stonks? Bruh, I got no money. The stocks owned by Mr. Dino have sold for double their original price. Therefore, he'll be receiving zero dollars. Thank you. I'm honored. All right, let's back that up. Thank God, we doubled up. Zero times two is still zero, as it turns out. You did blackjack strat with password entries. It is probably how you're, like, expected to win this game, yeah. We're saving a little time by not inputting the passwords. But the passwords, at least compared to fucking Wall Street, kid, are mercifully short. Back to blackjack. It's gotta be blackjack, there's no other way. This is where all the money is made. Give me an ace. 
You know what? I'll take it. 20? All day we take those. You're gonna hit 21 somehow, aren't you? Thank God. I was so convinced they were about to hit 21! <laughs> I was like, I was a hundred percent certain. Give me that password. Give me that. Cool. Watch this shit. This is the one. I got like a million bucks on this. I mean, it's only a 1 in 80 chance, right? It's pretty grim. It's pretty grim that you'd ever hit a single number. Oh, shit! Let's go! Well, we made $2.7 million that way. I'll take that. One in 20? Oh, I guess it calls like 15 numbers though, yeah, so it's closer to that. Alright, save right here. All we need is like a couple more wins then. Did we buy the house? We did. Now we're frivolously gambling. All we have to do is double up twice and we win. Thirteen. You hate to see that type of thing happen. Hit! Fuck. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I'm gonna hit again. Cause you're not gonna bust. You're gonna give me a five, and we're gonna hit 21. Check this shit out! Oh! Damn it. You know what? Good enough. Let's go. We're one win away. One win away from completing Vegas Dream. How much do you need? You need 10 mil to beat the game. So if we bet 5 mil and we win, presumably... The roulette table is calling. You know what? You're right. Hold on. You're right, Detour. This is the one. <laughs> yeah, I am right. Thank you for the 18 whole years. Big 18? Alright, check this out. Did I lose 5 bill? Did I? Oh, is it because I put it on the... Alright, hold on. I think it's because I, like, bet it first and then I left. Yeah, hold on. There we go. Uh, return, and then we just change games without dropping it on the table. There we go. That's pretty funny that you can just leave it there. All right, big 18. Watch this shit. Five mil on 18. <laughs> we really did. We put five mil on the table and we just left. It's going to hit 18. Guaranteed. Watch this shit. We did not hit 18. 29 again! It's a very popular number on this roulette wheel. Is this wheel weighted? By any chance? Is it lopsided? Is it heavier on one end? <laughs> Alright. Ball is magnetized. It must be. Well, all we gotta do is win one game of blackjack, and allegedly we win the game. Seventeen. They have a six, though. So they're gonna hit sixteen, and then they're gonna hit again, and they're gonna bust. Guaranteed, this will work for sure. Sixteen? Nineteen! I can't believe this. I'll never financially recover from this. Back it up. 
dawdle elsewhere to increment RNG. Used to play the shit out of this as a kid? Nice. I definitely didn't have this as a kid. I didn't even have an NES as a kid. I did have a Sega Genesis, though. <laughs> You're penniless! Alright. Get out, Blackjack. It's time to win this video game. Just give me the one hand I need. Shit! Do they have 20? They have 20, don't they? They've got a 20, I can feel it. You don't got 20. There's no way. Fuck! <laughs> they don't want me to win this last hand. They don't want me to succeed! I understand how it works. That's alright, we don't need to win at Blackjack because we're gonna hit this right here. We don't actually need to win at Blackjack because we can just hit this shit. Fuck. Was that 29 again? No, it was 36. Could have been worse. Could have been better. What if we win at Kino? What if Kino gets us there? What if we win this game by winning at Kino? What are these sequential numbers? Yeah, a lot of the roulette results have been, like, really... <laughs> it lands in, like, some specific places frequently. Certainly. Hold on, let me hop around a bit to increment RNG. Okay. Blackjack, this is the one. For sure. Nine? Give me 19. Fuck. I'm not thrilled with 16. But they're gonna bust. I already know they're gonna bust. Guaranteed. I already know. They don't have a face card. There's no way. 10? 15? 19. We had a shot. We had a shot, but they drew low. It seems like getting this last five mil is... ...a struggle. Just for some reason, they made getting the last five mil pretty hard. It's definitely Kino, though. Kino is the way. Right? Kino for sure. All right, fair enough. It likes to approximately land on the number we selected, and yet, not quite. Approximately. Forty-four has been consistent. This is gambling, not stock trading. Stock trading was the first, like, four hours of the stream or so. Once we completed Wall Street, kid, we immediately pivoted to gambling. Our newfound fortune. I'm sorry, Blackjack? Sure. Yeah, alright. Con 
Congratulations on your success! I think we just beat Vegas Dream. I think we did it. Mmm, feels good. Oh, bring me a beverage. We're at the fucking pool. We're just chilling. Yes, sir. John, the best one. Do you understand? Oh, we're telling the... Are we telling the bartender to give us the best drink? And also the best hors d'oeuvres! Hey, hey, keep your hands off, John. Your beverage and your hors d'oeuvres, sir. Mmm, this is good. Excellent. Oh, this glass is dirty. Who washed it? Smith, sir. Well, well, this just won't do. Tell Smith to work for his pay. And wait, call Mike for me. Did you call me, sir? Hello, Mike. Working hard? I'd like to ask you a favor. Give me a car for tonight. I'm gonna go to a show, okay? Yeah, that makes sense. Let's go, dude. We beat Vegas Dream. Yes! Get the limo out! That's not a limo. Never mind. Congratulations! Cool. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we were robbed at the show. We lost $10 million. <laughs> I believe it. We've done it. We've cleared Vegas Dream. Now, that would have taken, like... That would have obviously taken, like, ten times longer if we had kept putting in the password manually. So, presumably, if you're looking at the fucking real-life time spent, it's probably closer to, like, a three-hour game unless you explicitly just try to double up in blackjack over and over. But you're looking at, like, a two-minute ordeal putting in the password every time that you fuck up. It's a good game, though. We're gonna have to... Obviously, we have to play Vegas Stakes. We gotta play Vegas Stakes next. I don't know when that's gonna be. But this game did get a sequel. Got Vegas Stakes for the Super Nintendo. We're gonna have to play it eventually. Maybe sooner, rather than later. Because I do like me some, uh, some gambling video games. <laughs> John Vegas and John Wall Street. Yes, we'll fight to see who can spend money worse. Vegas Stakes used the mouse? Really? I had no idea. This is a HAL Laboratory joint, yeah. Thank you, Marie Yappy, for assisting the game. Gambling week? I don't know about all that, but I do like to sprinkle in a gambling game every now and then. Hal America Incorporated. It seems like we are trapped on this screen. The buttons? The buttons do nothing. Oh, there it goes. Okay, cool. So we went back to the title screen for, like, a frame. Cool. We've cleared the video game, then. Let's get the hell up out of here. I didn't think that would take, like, six hours to get through both of those, but I'm glad that we did. <laughs> you caught lying in 4K. It's fine. Thank you, everyone who tuned in. Thank you, everyone who stuck around. We're gonna have to play more silly games of this nature. Games about making financial decisions are absolutely not my strong suit. <laughs> but I love them anyway. We're probably going to do more. We're going to play more games about bad financial decisions. I don't know when that's going to be. Let's see who's on. Looks like Lee is doing Mario 64 co-op with Lucy Bluda. Oh, dude, they got the whole squad playing Mario 64. Yeah, let's go over there. 
I almost typed in slash Lythero like it's a command. Raid Lythero. Throw scoots at my good friend Lee. If you don't have scoots, <gasps> throw rack attacks at him. I will be back on Wednesday with something else. More gambling? More money games? I don't know. I'll think about it. But thank you for watching. I'll see you then. Bye-bye!